I'm not going to talk over this. I'm just going to let it go for a minute and then cut. Yeah, because your yeah, because your microphone's terrible anyway. You know no exactly. Louis Vuitton. That looks pretty good. Look, they have actual watchmaking equipment. <laughs> I'm surprised. <laughs> That's how precise that is. Holy shit. What's a robot? Speaking of robots. Speaking of robots. Daniel Katz, welcome to the show. I am a bot. Thank you. <laughs> We're good. Thank you all. Uh, Daniel, how, how have you been? Have you been basking in the post birthday haze uh, and post birthday <laughs> celebration? My conversation has been a bit stilted lately, ever since I met the CEO of Louis Vuitton. <laughs> Anyways, um, I got an idea mm -hmm. about my birthday uh -huh. to, to share. Maybe I work with Tim on this. It's improv, but there'll be a concept. And from the concept, we can improv it out. When I visit you in New York before heading on to San Francisco, uh, the end of this next month, I think. Okay. Uh, or the beginning of the next sure. month. I don't want to interrupt your you're not, Napa, you're not your Napa trip. Oh, yeah. well, when I'm in Napa, yeah. I'll, I'll give you the dates that I'm in Napa, so. Well, Just yeah, I'll, I'll see if I'm, I'm not going to Napa, I don't think. I'm going to, really? uh, the date may we not have, jive. I have one more, I think we can take one more. Part. Oh, okay. Well, let me look at the dates with the comedy thing. But I'm thinking of, you know, where I, I, I'm, I, I, you know, to answer your question, uh, mm -hmm. OC, I don't feel a day over 25 on my birthday. Yeah. By the way, if you have a comedy thing that's in conflict with like actually doing real socializing, you can just push the comedy thing. It's <laughs> no. the, the comedy, trust me, when I, I think I can speak on behalf of everyone when I say that <laughs> the comedy thing can be canceled. Oh, yeah. They don't need you. Oh. Okay. It's, hard. It, it's really hard. Yeah. I mean, it's really, really tough. Comedy is not easy. No. no, but yeah, I'll I'll check with her what the dates are because you're on the weekend. The Napa thing's on the weekend, right? That's right. So yeah, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Yeah. It might how come be Tim, how come, that, how come Tim, the Tim is the one wearing this the ski jacket, and you for a change are not wearing the giant uh, ski parka, Daniel? You it, got it. Oh, Andy. he's got a heater. Oh, space heater. There gotcha. Go. Yeah, yeah. That fixes it all. One of them broke because it fell off the table. Because I my hand swiped against it by accident. Mm -hmm. I tend to be very coordinated that way. OC. We have a fire. Be careful. Yeah, yeah, you have to be careful with those. I use uh, the kind of the the heater that looks like a little radiator. Uh, I look for them. They the stores I went to just didn't have them. Oh. Initially, I looked for those. Yeah. Restaurants like those more. Restaurants. The, the, a lot safe. That turns red, you know, the heat, yeah. Mm. Yeah. Red for heat. Yeah. Blue for cold. Shout out to JMB. Thank you so much, JMB, for reminding everyone to become members and not get upvote the live stream. If you're just joining us, we're going to talk today a little bit about these brand new Louis Vuitton La Fabrique du Tempus, these, these releases. Du uh, Tempus. It, did you say that right? Uh, can we have someone to check? These? Close can enough, man. These? Yeah, we need like a we need like AI to do like uh, English to French real li real uh, real time translation, so we can yeah, just say it in English. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. La fabri de tem or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> is it de tem? Is it de tem? Is it do you even pronounce like river it? river tem? Yeah, tem. Okay. No, I don't know. Uh, I have no idea. It's it's just what they called it. And how would, how would Waco pronounce it? That's what I want to know. Hey, did you see Waco's latest post on Instagram? No. Nope. Dude, you know, he went to PT Womo. 
Yeah, let me show you. Uh, Wait, the, the winter version? He went to the winter version of it, or or what are you referring to? Uh, no, no, he went to the summer version last year. Oh, Look yeah. Look yeah. The OG style demigod. Jesus, I, I had to look look closer. Yeah, yeah. Who is this guy on the left of Waco? Uh, a sartorial gangster. Cuban drug, Cuban drug lord. Alexandro Squarazzi. So oh, looked, my goodness. I was clicking this. I know match to those guys, but whatever. Oh, look at this. Squarazzi posted the IG. How many likes did this thing get? 4,800. All right. Very interesting. Oh, there he is again. Yeah, no, this is his profile. That's the. Oh, I see. Looks like he's some kind of a style aficionado, kind of like you, Daniel. But yeah, he's a lot bigger because he just he says he's a serious guy and people believe it. That's what you need to do. Oh, what's, he, what's that? That's what's, platinum what's paddock Calatrava. Oh, uh, I know match yeah. that. Oh my god! You That's know, I was really that. impressed. I was really impressed with the fear. What happened to OC? OC he disappeared into the vapor. Like yeah, his um, I, I kind of like the. I wasn't on stream, mm -hmm. but I saw, uh, you know, um, secretly behind the scenes. I saw the fears thing when you were going through fears watches, yes. and their special one that they had only ten made. Uh, an iteration that looked like the VC uh, 24, uh, was it Americano 24 or whatever? Mm -hmm. uh, that square watch. I really oh, like yeah. that piece. And uh, for a lot less than uh, Vacheron Constantine. Kind of no, something no, like along these No, lines. no, um, fancier than that. Something like that, but it's on steroids. It's oh, yeah? based on the version that they made in 1924. Fears has been around for much longer than I thought. Oh, well, it's revived. It's been revived. It's revived, but it's not like VC owns that design. They had no. that design also. That's right. Uh, that's the American 24 or whatever. It's, it's especially the piece that OC doesn't like. That's what uh, I'm like. Pedro <laughs> Bermudez, $2 Super Chat. Hi, Tim. And to the best panel on YouTube. Period. Thank you, oh. Pedro. Shout out to Pedro. He's a huge supporter of this channel Be really involved in the comment section guys i, I would actually yeah. highly recommend for people to try and engage in the comment section battles debates uh this is what we need more we need debates uh on in the comment section after the stream is over okay, like somebody but not but not go after each other's throats not after each other's throats, but like go over watches, debate some stuff. It, it, the, we need to make the comment section great again, please. So you want them? You want oh. them to not only watch the show for five hours, participate in the chat for five hours, super chat for five hours, and then after the show's over, rewatch it again and add comments. And, and you want to make the Hopefully. comments. And you want to make the com. Let me get this straight. You want to make the comments great again, not America great again. Yes, the comment section. Just the guy. Okay. I think All America right. is great. As, oh, as, yeah. okay. All it's right. Very, it's very good. I, I do not complain about anything that America has given me. Yes, I would have probably, if I wasn't in America, I would have probably died along with my with my childhood friend in Ukraine on the front line. Because right. that that's oh, yeah, the reality. Yeah, yeah. That's the reality, Dan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So what well, we will America, be doing though, we will be we will be making New York City right again in oh, twenty twenty five. Tim Wright, NYC, 2025.com. I can run for a mayor, soon. correct? Wait a minute. No, mayor. wait a minute. No, no, you can't. Because I was planning to run for mayor. Oh, you're Canadian, yeah. Daniel. You're I think Canadian. I don't... you're not coming. You have no. Tim Wright for mayor <laughs> coming soon. We're gonna make. We're gonna. We're gonna. We're gonna beef up the police. We're gonna wipe the homeless off the streets. We're gonna make New York City safe for wearing. Your yeah, wipe suit. wipe all that junk <laughs> off the streets with my glasses. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, I don't get it. That uh, didn't make sense. It didn't make no, sense. It I just threw sense. it in. That's, that's what it didn't make saying. sense at yeah. all. That's right. Yeah. No. It it really. It did. just felt good to say it. That's all. I don't know why. I get it. I don't like it. this. I don't like this watch. I'm sorry. The fears. Like no, no, not this one. There was another oh. version OC that uh, it's silver, and they did they did the thing just like the Vacheron version of their 
Was it American Twenty Four? Would be like it, they only made ten the ten of those. That's not the one either. It's not. It looks like it, but it's not the one at all. Good because this, this one's ugly too. <laughs> uh, they're they're very they're very ugly. I agree, but they okay. None of those do kind of harken back to to that. Like they do have actual heritage. Yeah, um, and they are making their watches in England, right? So if anything, it, it's kind of cool that. And then actually, I think this is son of uh, like one of the family members. He's got to be the grandson. I don't know about grand, son. maybe great, great, great grandson. great grandson. Yeah, one of them. But uh, yeah, so they revived this uh, watch brand. It's not a particularly good looking watch brand. We saw it in New yeah. York. I, I, there was something missing with it. Uh, oh, see, even me, I noticed something missing with it when I saw it in New York. After we went to Gotham, remember uh, after breakfast we popped in there. I think Tim. Mm -hmm. yeah, Tim in, did. Uh, I, I refuse to go over to watch time. Uh, what's the name of it? The wind up. The wind, the wind up. up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Winds. Could, and I, I got not, and I got lost and I got lost and uh, roommate had to look for me. Uh, America five seven two six ten dollars super chat. There's comedic instinct and then there's cat stinks. <laughs> All right. You earned a ten dollars super chat. Dance. That's pretty good. Okay. Kimbo. Hey guys. Hey, Daniel, you have to do more of those missed comedic timings jokes that don't make any sense. They bring in super chats. Okay. Yeah. 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 So you need to, okay. you, I, I, by the end of the show, you need to fire off like three more of these. No, stop. Buddy. Now you put pressure on me, then I, then I lose. <laughs> no, it's it. easy. Do it's that. just oh, make yeah. a joke. Simple. If it happens, if it happens, okay. I, I might break off for dinner. But okay. if it happens, hey, Kimbo. Kimbo. Does that mean that means walking over to your microwave to heat up a hungry man frozen dinner? That Pretty might be you, OC. Correct. I actually make dinner. <laughs> oh, you're gonna actually make it? Wow. Uh not be careful today. if there's I a stove involved. Yeah. Okay. Actually I cheated. I got some uh shaviti from a woman from Peru. Uh wait, what, what did you say? Good. It's I'm not maybe not pronounce it right. Uh Shaviti? It's a it's Ceviche. A Thank you. Yeah. Ceviche. That. Yeah. That's good stuff. Yeah, you've had it, right? We had it in Miami, Tim. Oh, right. I had some in Miami. Yeah. I, I I took I took some of your plate. Oh, you did. Hey, <laughs> hey just really quickly here, uh, Kimbo, Kimbo, what do you think? What do you think about this Fierce brand? Uh, no, no, not for me. Not Looks nice, not not for me. I so I got to be honest with you guys. There's this watch brand is has a little bit nostalgia to me. He's like, I don't want one. It doesn't to me. I don't know. I don't. I don't particularly like the design, so I wouldn't buy it. But I remember when I was just starting out uh, in the watches, like super early, early on, years ago, there was a video where Fierce CEO was doing interview. Maybe it was with Tim Maso or I don't know who it was, but they were doing interview and they were talking about like how they're bringing this company back and i thought it was very interesting that's why every time i see fears it kind of i get a throwback to that video so i do i don't know i think there's a little bit of that nostalgia but other than that yeah again again the piece that you couldn't pull up because maybe it's off the site i saw it this morning Mm -hmm. uh it's something like that but it's got the arabic numerals just like the vc american uh and it just it just finished better and there's a jus de Paris movement in the back uh mm -hmm. this is not the jus de Paris. it's a uh i think it's the ns7001 oh. oh yeah well they started out r with absolute garbage movements but but they're working they, their way up i think yeah. a lot of people say it's garbage tim g tim g says it's garbage Ooh. uh you know i i actually i gotta give credit where credit is due and this brand if it was garbage it would have died a couple of years ago like truly garbage brands they go out of business because there's too many watch brands right right now on the market so something's gotta fail and fears has persevered over the past like six seven years i think they're gonna stick around they might have built some kind of a sustainable business model where they might be able to keep keep it going 
You know what? I I I think that, go ahead, go ahead. I can assure you that the brand will not continue very long. If you pull up the image of the watch and then you tell the audience the price, Tim. (laughs) Well, it's, uh, they're not cheap. I I never said they were cheap. So for example, this salmon one, let's see, this cushion case salmon is $3,750. I, I know I know. yeah i know i know see i mean it, it, I, I it's think made in england it's not what, cheap what's the movement in this one uh scroll back up it doesn't matter it really it doesn't matter what kind I, of I see. it may being... not it may not matter to you but E-A for the watch, H-2-4. for the watch enthusiast <laughs> they, it matters eta wow they actually it's the got same it's, it's the same eta movement same eta movement that's in my 79 dollar calvin klein watch how about that no, it's not. No, no, no. No, no, really? no, no, no. I don't think so. Not that. And look at the dial. Actually, for seven, for for four thousand. Look at the applique numerals. They're badass. Yeah, you hands. know, the photograph looks better than when I saw it, Tim, at the show. So that I find that that's where photography or Mac or whatever you call it, photography works. I <laughs> went, I went and saw it at the show. Between times of getting lost and you may finding me, I I I found it something missing there. It doesn't look quite as nice as the photo here. But that's me. That's just an opinion of mine. I gotta be honest. I don't want to agree with OC all the time. This is a beautiful watch at eight hundred dollars. A hundred and fifty <laughs> water uh, meters water resistance. Look at that. I'm like, man, look at that. It's got ETA something to it. I don't know. I, yeah, I, salmon I, doll applied in the seas. Applied. Uh, Nice hands. Look at this onion crown. There's yeah. no way. Uh, I heard. I heard a little bit of that uh, when they were at the UK Watch Community Channel was at the British Watchmakers event. Uh, I think mm-hmm. it was yesterday or the day before, something like that. And they oh, said yeah. overall, they said that there were 50 brands participating there out yes. of the 100 British watch brands. Yeah. British, <laughs> I, I know, but but oh, see, fears is like the top, the one of the top, uh, right after. I, I would put fears as the. Actually, I would put fears as the top. Well, look, you got uh, no, 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 no. Well, look, because they had uh, Smith yeah, there. Yeah. Are right? you gonna Smith rank? Are you gonna you're gonna pick your pick your top five favorite British brands, British watch brands? Yeah, okay. yeah. Okay. It has to be number number one, right? Roger Smith doesn't I count, by the way. Roger Smith is is on a different level. So uh, remove Roger Smith. You you tell mm-hmm. me what your top five favorite British brands are out of this mm-hmm. illustrious list. I would say Fears is number one, and and f- f- because I know this brand for the longest time, I know Fears forever now. Like I when I started collecting, I'm telling you, this brand just okay. started out. And when they you, were garbage. They were way worse than they're right now. I'm telling you, it's the same watch, but they umped the quality. No what's joke. The, what's the thickness on this thing? Go back to that one. Go back. To uh, that one. Okay. Let me let me pull it up. The thickness is. Oh, and you have to put a deposit. You can't just order this. Yeah. Listen, I just want to say that 150 uh, meters water resistant. No, no, it doesn't say. It's 40 mil though. Hey, Tim G. Tim G. What's up? Tim G. I think it's camera. It was on, almost maybe. on. All I can say, Tim, is that we have nothing to fear but fears itself. <laughs> yeah. How long were you waiting to say that? We'll see. About five, <laughs> about five seconds. <laughs> uh, look, you guys make fun all you want. I think th- this this brand doesn't sell a lot of watches. They don't they don't have a lot of stock. But the stuff they have is kind of look at this. Like you zoom it in, that's not a half bad watch. You know, it's very simple and there's beauty and simplicity. They know what they can do. Like they know the the movement is shit, <laughs> so they closed it. But th- that's the good thing. Yeah, it. simplicity defined. Well, there Dude. you go. Look at that image. Boom! Look at that. They didn't put jack shit. They not tried to tell you this is automatic. They don't try to tell you that this is Swiss made. That well, they do put that it's England. That's the only thing they say. This is a watch, and it's made in England. And they don't they don't say, uh, oh, it's 150 more meters water resistance on the back. They don't say it's automatic. They don't say how many hours of power reserve. They don't need uh, to advertise that stuff because they're not selling this watch. To watch people, they're selling this to patriots. 
wait a minute. I think a few watch people will buy that as, um, you know, a beat around as a beater to some extent. Yeah, it could be I a great so. beater. I'm kind of yeah. digging it. I want one. Oh, what's wrong with me, guys? Uh, Brody, $5 super chat. If one can lie to and convince himself the code 1159 is even a good watch for 30K, then surely fears is also good value. Boom. That's exactly right. I'm loving this color. Look at this. Look at this. What the fuck? Yeah, yeah. I'm even digging the bracelet. Yeah. Oh, see, I lost my mind, I think. Yeah, it's yeah. Good. We yeah. well, we kind of knew that for a while. No, no, it's it's a good watch. I don't know. It's okay. That's oh, why. Wait a minute. I, I, for, I forgot about Christopher Ward. Christopher, Christopher Ward. Ward. Christian is it up Ward. there? Christian. No, not in my opinion. Christian Ward. Uh, okay. I mean, oh, oh, it's fifth. It's oh, number oh, five for me. Okay, hey, okay. Tim G. Hey, oh, see, do you do you care about any of these brands? Well, let's go through the list again. I mean, this is this is total Anglo Anglo crap, in my opinion. From <laughs> all these brands. All these brands, I mean, they're like they're like one 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 watch wonders. Okay, I mean, it's just a third of these brands aren't going to be around in five years. Why only? Why only a third, Tim G? Why not ninety percent? Okay, I mean, what, can, can we pick? Can we can we pick five winners and 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 tell all the other ones to go? Out I, of I personally, I personally think Christopher Ward, unfortunately, is going to be around. Okay, unfortunately, because they're whores. But Bremont's going to be around because the two brothers are. are have more money than God, but basically, and obviously, Roger Smith is 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 the best of the best. So that's wait, that's, was Bremont here? A B. Uh, I, I doubt it. They're probably too they good. weren't here. Or they're too good or something. They're too good. Okay, I I don't, I don't know. I I don't see it. I mean, this is all Anglophile crap, in my opinion. This is this would be a total waste of my time to go to this show. I I, I love the English watch. Hey, guys. I love you know them. what? You know what? what? Hold on a second. I just uh well, what about this show? There's another show on the horizon. It's called oh Time London. Over 30 brands. It's gonna take look at the locations. Look at this. Yeah, that looks nice. But as long yeah. as it, if it doesn't have Rolex, Patek, Adam RP Gay, uh, I mean <laughs> Uh, why, By the way, why, bother? why bother? Why bother? Because one wait, of these brands. I can't wait to attend. I can't wait to attend this event in London. The keynote speaker is Archie Luxury. Oh, yeah. nice. <laughs> one of these brands could be the next Rolex. So you guys don't know that. Uh, the, oh, li yeah, you're coming. No, literally, the keynote speaker of the conference is Archie Luxury. That's hilarious. No, Ray, Ray McKinney. <laughs> yeah, that's not true. I actually love England. I love London. I love. I I really love Scotland. I mean, Tim G's Scotland. talking to the chat. Can I give a, a watch? Yeah. Can I give a speech as well? Should I talk to to D? You weren't invited. You weren't invited. You know. What well, you mean? What I wasn't invited? I want. Is Luxury actually going to give a? Is he really the keynote speaker? Yes, he he's going to give, and he's going to be on a panel. Why the digital watch fault is right for you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Keep him coming. Listen. Yeah. He's going to he's going to talk about the ease of use, uh, <laughs> and it's. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you can't make this stuff up. No, I'm not going to London for that. I'm sorry. I mean, it's I mean, gonna be hilarious. Go to, though. You go to London to have a good time in London. You don't. Yeah, go to let's watch. go have a good time, OC. <laughs> watch it, and you pay a for you pay a fortune because the the, the hotel prices are are probably amongst. Well, you you're in New York, so I can't say anything. But anyway, the um, uh, you know, forget 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 this. Seriously, forget this. It's a total waste of time. I mean, Dubai was phenomenal. I, I mean, I, everyone needs their own. You know, the British were so stuck up in 1887 that when you see made in China or made in the USA or made in, they invented that. They wanted only their own um, manufacturers to have that. And it's like some law of 1887. And what happened was, when they put down made in Switzerland or made in Germany, people ended up in and came to London. People ended up buying more of those products because of made in Germany, made in Switzerland than made in England. So they kind of like it kind of like douched them, so to speak. So long, long story short, great country, great people, pretty good food now. 20 years ago, that was not as good, but now they've it's it's really oh, you, had, you had me at good people. I mean, but 
Good food. But, uh, in, in any event, beautiful culture. I support the queen, which Timmy doesn't, okay? The queen's so, dead, by the way. The king, the king. Yeah, yeah. The, the king. queen or the king. Oh, right, right, exactly. So Long in live any the event, queen. I mean, king. But, I mean, those watch brands, they're going to be like, they're going to be done in, in five years. They're going to be done. Done. You know, pick the but, brand. But that here's, okay, done. okay, hold on. Relax, relax, Tim G. It's just an ETA watch. The fears, that's the beauty. The 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 fears as a brand might be done. You might be right. But you know I mean, what? Yeah, why, just buy, why buy why not just buy a Hamilton watch? You've got an in-house movement with the with them. You've got you can get them for six hundred bucks. You can buy them on Amazon because for like four fifty. They don't Hamilton make Hamiltons back. in England. They don't make them with love, care, attention. They don't. They don't I do mean, it. If, the if, same it was, way. if it was such a great watch place, Rolex, the, whoever his name was back when, wouldn't have moved the shop to Switzerland. He started there, but he moved it to Switzerland. Why did he move to Switzerland? Because because basically Cheaper. that's where the watch mecca. Cheaper. He and he he was anti-American. He, he he exported his business out of America into Switzerland. He 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 took our jobs. And even even right? I, even I W C. Even IWC, you see he the was difference. A... This guy, this I, this uh, Hamilton. Oh no, no, wait, Hamilton. Did he? I think he was making stuff in America. No, it was the IWC. False alarm. Right, but now, but now Hamiltons are made in Switzerland as well. So it's like, dude, if it's an American brand, make it in America, and that's why Fears is a, an important brand because it's a statement. It's not about the watch. It's about saying, you know what. I love my country and I will pay more for less because I want to I want that money to go to my fellow citizens. You understand? Yeah, I I do, but half of those brands aren't going to be around in 5 years. Yeah, they may or may not be, but ETA is going to be around forever. That's a Swiss. That's actually a Swiss movement right there. Oh, absolutely. So, but uh, okay. let's go let's go to ETA. ETA yeah. was was a spin-off from Eterna. Which was a watch company, it, which they still make watches. I think they make them in in hey. China now. Oh, that, that's it's wonderful. Sunday. It's Sunday. I'm gonna pour myself a little bit. I'm gonna give myself a little treat. Anyway, I, I think I just alienated the whole panel. And no, and no, before that, I'm gonna so, say I'm a, uh, five pounds super chat from cheeky uh, from cheeky winders. Cheeky Tim, winders. did you see Paul Thor pretending not to see Red Shovel? In his watch show video, five minutes thirty seconds. I let's play it. Let's play it. Okay, here we go. Are you ready? I I did not watch it. Okay, I did not see this. This is first time I'm hearing about this. We're here at five minutes and thirty Jeez. seconds. I've seen uh, who have I seen here? Ten tickers has been here, and it's Ricky from Sky Watches, uh, Russell the Man Watch Collector. <laughs> There's uh, quite a few of the boys. <laughs> he said hi to him. Damn! He's literally talking about which people he's seen here. Free and then he the turns the up. camera around and he sees Red, and Red Shovel. Red Shovel and is, dominates the frame and, point, and basically points. Hi, Paul. He's looking at him, but he can't see Look him. At, I see how it is. I'm trying to bring... Boom! The no, camera no, no. is dead on Red Shovel. Keep going. He's, he, he, Red Shovel he even gives it. a thumbs up. Red yeah, Shovel stop, gives stop a thumbs dream. up, but but Paul cannot see him. It's he's invisible to Paul, but maybe he can see him. But this know, looks like a very very sad event with like a like a table and a banner. Uh, it's just not my kind of watch. Show. What, <laughs> dude? It's done in one of the most prest. It's like in the castle. Do you understand? You wow, it has zero west there like it has to yeah. be a good event it, yeah exactly it was pretty good zero west they were served uh, oh but i believe red shuffle mentioned the the biggest complaint was there was no drink so everybody was just sober walking around looking at watches it's not uh it's not normal uh bala what is this a, th a thousand One thousand hoof, hoof? What the? F this is something new. Is that Hungarian of, uh, something? That's weird. Hungarian francs, maybe. I, I think Hala super chatted, Bala super chatted before, and it was like Canadian. What is this huff stuff all about? All of the UK eats like a like the Germans are still flying overhead. 
<laughs> Vertex M100A murders any Hamilton and most other field watches other than Explorer 1. There you go. Wow, Yo, that's Tim. a very generous super chat. That's, yeah. uh, that's $250. That's a Hungarian forint. Jesus. I uh, I went I, I went to the Omega boutique today to see the the white um, the white speedy. Yeah, I asked yeah. them about it, and they were like, "Yeah, there's a list right now." And he was the essay was like, "Hey, if you want to be higher up on the list, you know, you have to establish a relationship with the uh, Omega." Oh no! They actually said that. The, yeah, to get the the new white Speedmaster, and you know what I told him? Uh, to f off. I I told him that I'll wait to buy it online. <laughs> so that's bad. One, I'm not buying shit other than that watch. Two, you just lost a customer, and a sale because well, I'll just buy it online when it comes out online. Yeah, I don't think I don't think you'll be buying it. Yeah, I don't think you're gonna you buy it. Yeah, you. Don't, I, I, I like it. It looks really good. I actually like you're, it. You're not buying it. You're not buying it, Cam. Come on now. Yeah, you can't Stop afford buying. it. Don't lie to us. Uh, uh, newsflash, Hawk currency is Hungarian, or do you know that already? Hawk. Yes, the, yeah, it's the Hungarian forint. Yeah. Okay. Ah, okay. It's 278 All right. It's the $8,000 watch. Yeah, it's expensive. Are you, are you working? Uh, how's, how's your job going? Any opportunity yeah. to, huh? Pretty good. Pretty I mean, good. What's your salary right now? Like, is that okay to ask? Is that? It's pretty good. Oh yeah. Is yeah? Can you tell us like estimate? Like, is it six figures? Is it five figures? Is it high five figures? Low five figures? If it's pretty good. Then he, works for for he works for BCG, so he's making at least a hundred thousand. Yeah. Why couldn't you pay? That's for really dinner? good. I uh, think he can afford uh, seven a figures, white seven. master. Seven figures. Oh, very nice. I make, seven I make millions. Figures. I mean, no, yep, no, set, no, yep. I make millions. I'm good at what I do. Wait, so if you make seven I figures, do. why don't you pay for dinner? Why do we still let you on after you skipped uh, skipped out on the bill? Hey, sometimes that's why they hire me. I, it's strategy. You know, we do a lot of strategy work. Okay, goodbye. Oh, no. Okay, come back. Gatsby. Gatsby, thank you so much for being a member for eight months. I have seen more impressive display at high school science fair. Yeah. Go. If you go to a high school, any any high school gymnasium in the country, they, they when they have like a science fair or like an employment fair, mm -hmm. it looks way better than that. Dang. Truth. Would you guys get the Omega? The the new one? The new white Omega? I I yeah. think I'm gonna try to to do that. Yes. At this point, at this point, it's clear that 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 white dial Omega Speedmaster is the watch of the year. It will have the biggest impact of any single watch of the year at this point because it'll mm -hmm. it'll it has it just it will have the biggest impact. It'll sell the mo it'll sell a big number of units. And I think two days after the AP announcement came out, it's really like it's like those are dead on arrival. I hate, I hate to hate to say it. There's nothing in what the AP releases that's actually going to move the needle for them at all. They better come out with some new Royal Oaks, Tim, because what they came up with is interesting, but it's still way too expensive. And no one's no one's suddenly going to start buying codes because of what happened two days ago. Those codes yeah. weren't distinct enough. I I wanted m more changes. Like that was a little bit. Yeah, Tim, it, it's it's like a Seamaster inspired watch. Uh, what the code? The, the new white, dial. no, the new white. Dial. Oh, the white one. yeah, yeah. I like, it's exactly it's the same as dial, the right? It has the same design, like the exact same design as the Seamaster 300, the white dial. Well, it has those lugs that cur curl on from the inside out. Yeah, so the case is the same. The case is similar, but the dials are different. The Seamaster is a ceramic dial, and uh, the C the Speedmaster is a is an enamel dial. I mean, no, the uh, way that lacquer, white, white lacquer. The way they do the the indices and the hands and stuff. Like the second hands is red, just like the three hundred. The, the Speedmaster logo is red. Like it's the exact 
kind of same. Yeah, because that was, that's I, a formula that worked for the Seamaster. It was a, a winning formula. I don't know what took him so long with the Speedmaster to do it, but it's a good looking watch. That one build up. They're building up the hype. Brody Brody uh, showed a Speedmaster that he has, I think, from two thousand seven, and it has a black uh, uh, enamel, a special edition. Ooh. Oh, is, is that really, the fifty eight? Really the nineteen fifty? Yeah. yeah, that fifty seven. Uh, yeah, yeah fifty seven. Nineteen fifty seven. Yeah, we have actually uh, uh, in the chat uh, a gentleman who has that one. We actually did the unboxing a while back. So crazy. And it huge has shout a out to, by the way, to, huge shout out to Hawaiian Standard Time, who's in the chat, saying hi to me. Oh, Hawaii. What's up, HST? Hope everybody oh, had a good, uh, good sleep and moved their clocks forward, sprung their, their day forward by one hour. It's uh, not 4.30 right now. It's 5.30. That was really annoying. I, lo I lost an hour today. <laughs> Just for doing nothing. And you know you know why there's still daylight savings? Actually, you know why there's daylight savings in the United States, OC? Uh, I'm sure it's politics and something else. I'm not sure. It's golf course related. The basically course. because... <laughs> yes. The golf lobby lobby to to have the extended hours because it's the farmers the farmers the farmers, farmers like farmers don't yeah. give a fuck i mean that's that's a matter for the farmers it's for because farmers wake up on their own time look at big meach case in point uh no no it's the golf right because people have a job from five to nine or from nine to five sorry um and after five they want to go and play right you move look look at this you move one hour back it's still light we could be playing for an hour you see that yeah could be else also a big lobby is the american grillers association they are uh, they're backed by weber and a lot of the big barbecue companies and they want people out grilling so they want it to be lighter for longer so they're out there grilling yeah. little known fact <laughs> Hey, so, oh, by the way, this Verdix watch, it just so happens that it's the Verdix that Paul Thorpe is looking at before he sees Red Shovel. So let's watch this movie. Let's learn a little bit. What does Paul Thorpe think of Verdix? Second World War. There will be a oh, uh, British right. military. It, uh, this company has uh, a big history. They used to make watches for the British military back in the uh, Second World War. There will be Shout out to the um, poppy. some uh, That's right. more in-depth... <laughs> Where is the poppy? Where is the poppy? Let's check that display. There's not a poppy in sight. No poppies. No poppies. Huh. I wonder why. Now, as I said, guys, they, uh, this okay. company has uh, a big history. They used to make watches for the British military back in the uh, Second World War. There will be um, some uh, more in-depth reviews of a lot of these watches. I've seen, uh, who have I seen here? TN Tickers has been here. And there's Ricky from TN Spice Tickers Watches. came? I can't uh, believe Russell, the Mad Watch Collector. There's uh, quite a few of the boys here. So um, you won't? He's... Oh, he referred to Red Shovel as one of the boys. There you go. Yeah. It's, I guess it's a nice. compromise. That's an endearing, endearing lumping in. Yeah. One of the He's boys. Got, he got lumped in with the boys. Mad Watch Collector. There's uh, quite a few of the boys here, so um, you won't be on up with a bit of Solum? footage. <laughs> is a guy named Solom? <laughs> I don't know who that is, uh, but Mad Watch Collector was there. Look at that. Adrian Barker was there, and uh, there was a whole bunch of people. We'll, we'll take a look at some Instagram posts in a second. Check this out. Pan oh, yes. Good one. Mike S., member for 25 months thank you so much uh mike s for your continued support it's uh it's greatly appreciated man it it really it really helps uh pick, picking up the pam 915 I, I have the 914 you're getting the 915 the 915 has the little running seconds at nine o'clock probably the better choice i don't know i went super conservative with mine very nice pickup, Mike S. Congrats. Congratulations, Mike S. Good stuff. 
Look at that. Congrats. Congratulations. It's pretty cool. These are really nice. I know everybody wants me to sell them. Tim, sell them. Yeah. Yeah. So running seconds is better, I think. Yes. Hey, yours, yours, yes. yours stinks. Why don't you buy the running seconds? Uh, no, I can't. It's extra. It's like eight hundred dollars extra. Eight hundred. Oh, okay. You know what? I'm not made of money here. I was I was drunk on Delmore, <laughs> but I was still just I was still trying to save my own skin. Uh, hey, we got Dirk Diggler in the chat. Uh, where are all the uh, oh? Yeah, wow. we, have, we have more diversity on this panel than they did at this London uh, watch event, the British mm -hmm. w watchmaking event. Wait, what kind of people did you have at the British watchmaking event? Oh shit! Oh, look around. Right. Take a look. Take a look. Well, yeah, England. Man. Oh, is that Adrian? I'm gonna show you in a minute the brand. That's, but they, uh, they got different. Like they got the Welsh, they got the Irish, right? They got diversity in a different kind. Different kinds of white people. It's not like all same it's, kind of it's white just, people. It's just different neighborhoods, Tim. <laughs> different, different neighborhoods. neighborhoods. <laughs> really they got white people life. with good teeth. They got white people with bad teeth. <laughs> that's right. White people with medium teeth. And these look like tutors. Mm hmm. What is this? There's so many brands, OC. Too many brands. We didn't. You didn't go back. You should go back to your list and try and pick another. You said you picked Fears as one brand. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. I, I think it'd be hard to find a couple more. I mean, that, that uh, well, survive. Zero West. I, I'm kind of a fan. Of they, West. they don't deserve what? to be around. How about William Wood? How about William Wood watches? William Wood no. is cool. Yeah. No, they, no, no, no. They just had a gimmick and and they got their name out there a little bit, but that doesn't make them more qualified or more deserving or better than any of the brands that we've never heard of. Cool. William Wood? Any, any, yeah. I mean, William Wood, uh, the ones that, uh, Zero West. Zero West, they got an idea, but the Zero West, that, that, that's a pretty original idea to do the whole World War II. Yeah, that doesn't I don't think it makes it better. It, it's not for it's not for watch people, you see. It's for for people who like war. Right? If you like <laughs> war or history of war, stupid. It, no, but it's a thing. It's like normal people also have to wear watches and this kind of appeals to normal people. Oh, the way they just they just some of them the flag are the flight it's so over in your face. Is this Oshin video? Did Oshin did this video or no? Oh no no no, not this one. Okay, this is pretty cool. Look, they're it's a thing. OC. what are you gonna do? Air. Thing. Look, they got it's look for left, page. right. <laughs> it's in the plane. In a plane. Left <laughs> turn, right turn. Wings. <laughs> this is what this is that thing that's supposed to tell you. Which way the plane is leaning? It's it's yeah. I I would be more concerned with uh, the case and these knurled out parts. I don't get. I don't, like, I don't really. That, that part I actually kind of don't mind. Oh it, yeah. At least at least it's different. Then what the f is this crown? This it's it's awkward. It looks it looks too crazy. Like the crown is stands out too much. It's different color, it's brass, it's got some black button. If you're saying that this is the watch that people are wearing when they get shot down and crash, all right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It goes down with the plane. If the watch goes, goes down with the down, plane, I'm all for it. Goes down with the plane. Own piece of British history. You see this? A piece of British history, man. Look at that. See? They're not gonna get it. I understand, and and they got that piece of piece of the plane in the case back. Again, yeah, but it's a real thing. And hey, they're they're doing it best, right? There's so many brands that that make like they say this is a Venice watch, and then they put a, a picture of Venice on the back engraving, it's, and they say like, hey, there you go. At least this has a real piece of a plane that existed that fought in World War II. 
right? In, in a way, this is it's much cooler. It's the story here that counts. It's not the watch. Ooh, Cam, what do you think? This is this is not your kind of thing because you how how you're probably asking yourself how do you flip this to make money, right? No, I, it's like how do I steer this thing? Do I is it like a skid steer steering wheel steer. or yeah? Have you, you haven't seen a skid steer? No. What's that? Well, look it up. Skid steer. Okay. Um. No. Yeah, I don't know what that is. But yeah, let's keep going. Let's. Uh, is there any more good British watchmakers out there? Zero West, Wessex. Look at this one. It's got a flag of Britain on it. How, how patriotic. Oh, shoot. Look at this. Is it a stamp the, uh, dial or did it actually do that? Oh, good question. Look at this. Let's see. Um, it's got to be stamped. Created in order solid. Oh, engraved and hand painted. I don't know. It's it, it's just it is what it is. I mean, it's very old style. Is this for priests? Look at that. Are these for for priests? Who buys this? It's it's kind of it's too much. <laughs> I feel like it's too old school. It's like a water clock, <laughs> right? Jeez. I mean, go back to the specs. Go back to the specs. Let's, let's read what's in there. Movement. So, well, the website is totally out of whack. Go back down. Uh huh. Go to the movement. Does it say? Yeah, go down. Go down. Uh, here we go. Movement is. Now keep going down. Uh, there it is. Keep going. Keep oh, going. here we go. ETA and SDP. Salida. Salida. Three one three one six L. Yeah. Uh, look, there's weird stuff. There's weird stuff there. British watchmaking scene is kind of, yeah, it is what it is, yeah. right? It's a bit of a community. I'm shocked by how many English brands. watch brands there are, and that's only like you, you choose. You should choose them just by looking at the name the logo and a quick glimpse of the watch and that should be enough <laughs> uh, there's there's some oh look, look at this what the oh it's a fashion brand crusader photochromic glass jesus okay too many it's bad like, ideas it's I don't, I don't get it. It's so. That's a hand, by the way. Yeah, look at that hand. It gets, it's pretty cool. Why is it like that? See the hour hand? Uh huh. See what it does? I don't get it. It's one hand, right? Or is it two hands? No, the, the, ha the hand crosses the line of the number of the hour. See that? Oh, so, so right now it's two o'clock? Yeah, it's, it's 2 35. Oh my god! Because it's, it's gonna because that's gonna move up. That's crazy, huh? Who thought of that? It's pretty cool. But look, it's in the in the absolute shit, shit of a watch. Yeah, the case. Uh, <laughs> I don't know about that. Yeah, this you, get, you, you give that to, give that to Ludovic Ballard, and he'll charge ninety thousand for it. Yes, but he'll make a proper case. As yeah. of right now, this is a waste of potential. It's a, it is an interesting complication. Of the engineering is kind of interesting, right? Like to, yeah. to be able to figure out how the the hand will cross the number at those exact points. Yeah. Right. Yeah. It's probably done in uh, in a computer, but it's fascinating. That is what's brought to life. BW says, "I don't think I ever heard of more than three or four of these. These are very. There's a lot of very small brands here." And there's some that actually been around, but it really takes it takes a long time to bring a brand to life truly. 
Yeah, these guys have only had uh, about 175 years <laughs> to establish their brand. Just a little bit longer, a few more decades, they'll be able Just to get it right. Just a few more decades. Just give them time. They'll figure it out. Look at this one. Oliver Malin. It's like everyone on the planet thinks they're a watchmaker now. What is this? I wonder if this guy's related to Eduard Malin, the guy who is responsible for a Moser. I think that's the last name of the guy who the CEO of Moser. Maybe it's like yeah. the Olivier Melan. Maybe it's like the cousin or brother or something. It's, that's like know. a brother, like the loser brother who's trying <laughs> to write the coattails of his brother. Right? It makes perfect sense. Like, hey, his brother succeeded. But so there's going to be some people. I can be in watches buy. too. Yeah, but there's going to be someone who will buy him just because of the association. Oh, that's his little brother, his special needs. Okay, yeah, just buy one of his watches as well. It's a wow. it's a good thing to do, a little bit of charity. I've had my fill of British watches. i got to jump out for dinner. Peace out, guys. Have a great show. Peace see out. Bye-bye. Right, bye. I will see him. All right, all right. Uh, yeah, this was... Uh, Interesting stuff. All right, let's get back here to to the beginning where we where we're we're talking about the Louis Vuitton. I am freaked the f out right now. Okay? Why? Because I watched this LV presentation of their fa Fabrique de Temp, right? Their factory, and the quality of work they're producing, and just the tools they have it's like state of the freaking art yeah so, look at that geneva seal on there yeah, yeah they got the geneva seal they got this is a torbian look at this movement it's so it's like the most beautiful thing look they got the colors and man the artisans they got working here like this is some next level stuff i think it's pretty nice the, the movement itself is pretty nice Look at their What's hand the... painting. Look at the look at this machine. I mean, this is scary stuff. All right, any watch ma watchmaker or other Swiss watchmakers, they freaking they better start freaking out because Louis Vuitton, they're not playing anymore. See, they weren't showing this in the past, right? For the past. Uh, you know, I've been collecting watches for like six, seven years, and I've never seen any anything like this from Louis Vuitton, like them showing how their watchmaking capacity. They were just treating it as just a business, and they weren't engaged in the competition, in the race for being the top watchmaker. Now they are, and jeez, this is scary, man. They got some crazy machinery here. Look at this stuff. Cam, would you ever buy a Louis Vuitton watch when you succeed? Uh, I already have a product from Louis Vuitton. Oh, yeah? But do you have a watch? But do you have a watch from Louis Vuitton? I don't. Maybe that should be the next one you get? Probably not. Uh, Louis Vuitton's not a watchmaker, so why would I do that? They're a canvas maker. Look at this. What do you mean they're not a, a watchmaker? Look at the machinery they got here. Look, look at this. The, they're making watches under a microscope. How can you say they're not a watchmaker? This is next level watchmaking. This is not just, this is not putting together quartz, quartz parts. This is some. I love OC ninety one's like comment. OC ninety one or keychain. Which yeah, one? This comment. What do you have, Cam? The orange paper bag. What do you? The fuck is what for me? What? What the do you have, Cam? The orange paper bag. Hmm. What the fuck is that? I don't know. It's a good question. What, what could it be? But I OC do have one. I I have a LB keychain. You have a keychain from LB, Tim? Oh no, I don't. I do. You should get cool. one. Why don't right. we show Cam all the Louis Vuitton watches that they're making now, so he understands what they're getting into? Because they are a watchmaker. 
I mean, okay. Yeah, let's see. Well, uh, put it this way. Louis Vuitton is very big. And one of the departments, not the original department, one of the departments is watchmaking. They have watchmaking directors, original horologists, some of the best talent in any other, in, amongst other watchmakers camp. They have a department. Originally, LVMH was, was a clothing or other stuff. I don't know what it originally was, but it's a big company that has many departments. This is one of them now. And they've uh, acquired uh, some of the best people to direct the other watchmakers. And they have, they come out with some pretty good stuff. Wow, yeah, nice. Like how do you tell time on the right watch? On the right one? You see, there's a 10. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right? what else? And, uh, and then you have to look somewhere else to tell the other the minutes. I don't know where. No idea. No idea. Probably maybe in the center, the red dot and the blue dot. I don't know. It's confusing. But it is, it is like... It's different. really good quality art. Like look I, I at the, could, look at the little straps that they're starting to use. Look at the green one. Look how different it is versus what we're normally yeah. seeing. Like you look at this and you realize, okay, this is true art because think about another brand that does this, but as a joke, like Aventi, right? Aventi, like compare Aventi to that ceramic case one in the left no, no no sorry not ceramic it's sapphire i think it's a full sapphire, sapphire case with like some kind of sapphire carve outs running between the tourbillon oh, you see like well they're it's crazy price difference what's the what's the price on the left well the price way is different a hundred thousand dollars exactly venti venti wanted to do all that with the 15 with the price in mind so you can't yeah, really compare but, the two this is but this this is like this is this says we have unlimited money we oh, can that's pretty cool anyone. in this case Right, cool. it's mental. The, the it, designs are too crazy for me, but the the watch itself, if it didn't have these crazy designs, would yeah, be pretty fucking cool. Huge props to whoever designed this because, like, you have to imagine this and then sketch it out in some kind of a three D program. You have to make sure that the hands and everything doesn't overlap over each other. I mean, this is some this is tough work. And they had this one for the year of the dragon, I guess. Yeah, look at that. That's really nice. Very yeah. How much is this? Uh, let's check. It's a really expensive camp. Okay, so the what? The first one. Oh shit! The ceramic one is one million dollars. This one's nine oh, wow. nine hundred thousand. <laughs> this is like Jacob and Co. <laughs> what the fuck? No, but this is better. It's actually wearable. Jacob and Co. They're way bigger. <sighs> but there you go. I mean, listen, you wanted it, you have it. High art. This is Mona Lisa of watchmaking. One million dollars with taxes. With taxes, all in. It's one million dollars. Holy shit! I mean, look, there are Richard Meals that are more expensive than this. So why? What's the problem? What's everybody complaining about? It's expensive. That's like my whole year salary, Tim. Come on. Whole year? So, hey, two yeah. years, you can get one. What's the big deal? See your ramen noodles for a whole year. What are you doing? This could be yours. Yeah. Yeah. Let's get out on it. All right. Let's, what's the prices of the, the other ones? Uh, I'm still shocked that this is 900000 Okay, let's go to the next one. Now these the dragon and the koi pond, two hundred seventy thousand. Okay, that's a little bit more reasonable. Two seventy. This Man, is unbelievable. Crazy. Yeah, it's very nice. Is that a red ruby right there for the eye? This looks like more for the Asian market. What, what would know. you say about this? Yeah, because it's the year of the dragon. It's for the Chi it's for the Chinese market probably. It has like a samurai uh, like band. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, so that, interesting. That's, interesting. So, oh. So, okay. Okay. That's pretty cool. And then look at that. Now, I'm not sure about this one. What is this for? I I know uh, the yeah. dragon one. Yeah. Yeah. 
And this one, Yin Yang. No, no, no. Have you watched Avatar? No, Koi. Just having Koi, I guess. Just the Koi Pond? Yeah, Son of Wealth, I guess. Well, Well, that's Japanese, right? Koi is Japanese. Probably. I don't know. Okay, so okay, maybe we'll have a pattern. Have you ever watched Avatar The Last Airbender? Yeah. Only the first few episodes. Remember the the koi fish that they uh, always swim in the same direction, black and white? And if you take one out, like the earth disrupts or something. Really? Yeah. All right, I missed that part. Okay, go down. Let's surprise the next one. The third, the jumping hour one. Okay, here we go. Next one. Oh, then we got this one. Oh, okay. The green one is two, also 270. This is limited to 20 pieces. Was this the snake? Oh, that's nice. Yeah. The intricate artwork. Yeah, this is probably the best one. Look at that case design. I know. Side wow. engraving. And lo- it looks like a Louis Vuitton, um, you know, trunk. Yeah, this, yeah, yeah. This is the design from the trunk. Yeah. And the lug. What's what's on the crown? Is that a, like some sort of gem? Some kind of just... a green and gray enameling. Man, this is yeah, nice. LV. It's so cool. It, it's next level. It's fucking gorgeous. Oh yeah, this one. Oh yeah, you see, there's a comp. Oh, there's that's, a okay. That's wow, the middle. that's pretty cool. Okay. Holy shit! <laughs> there it is. That's pretty cool. This yeah, is forget... actually. This is actually cool. Forget your Snoopy going around in 14 seconds. Fuck that. Yes, this is so this, much cooler. Dude, and, and they, I think they purposely did this because, hey, it's like a kind of a more expensive Snoopy. It's the next level of Snoopy. Do the yeah. other dials change? Like, you see that blue thing in the, on, on the bottom left? Does that change? This, yeah, I think this is running seconds. Mm. I think it's going to rotate. So that shows you uh, the, the sign of life. Okay, this is pretty cool. Wow. Uh, it's probably a woman's watch with all the diamonds on the on the bezel. But Dude, I would wear it any day of the week. You just pretty cool. Pretty cool. What's yeah. the price on this? Um, uh, oh, uh, one hundred eighteen. Ah, that's not bad. Yeah, that's that's actually possible. <gasps> that's oh, and there's two versions. You see, there is this one with the in space, but see here, she's painting it sakura colors. Oh, this is like Hello Kitty colors. Imagine it's yeah. like a Hello Kitty collab with Louis Vuitton. Oh, man, that'd be crazy. Oh, yeah. Look at this. She's got one single hair paintbrush. Oh, man. Imagine if you colored outside of the lines. Oh, <laughs> you're fucked. This is very impressive. Louis Vuitton. This is what I'm t- saying. Louis Vuitton is scary good. So, Louis, I'm going to go, but Louis Vuitton you guys have already figured out has got artists that just specialize on this and they're probably respected just as much as the watchmakers or whoever does the movements or more so to make the dials. They're, they're just amazing work. Yeah. It's very nice. They source the type of talent. Yeah. Both art and uh, watchmaking together. This is, this, this is yeah. Nice. yeah. Goodbye guys. I'll try to see you later. Okay. Right, bye Daniel. Okay. I'll drop the link if anybody wants to join us on the show. The link is in the chat. Hop on. Let's talk some watches. Let us know what you think. Guys, let us let me know what do you think about the Louis Vuitton watches? Does this do anything for you? I mean, obviously, these are completely out of any normal person's price point. But I feel like, like this is foundational, like really beautiful stuff. Well, not everybody agrees. Like Rohik says, it's so cheap looking. It's not cheap. No, 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 no. It's not cheap. Not cheap. What about the tambor? Would you get the tambor? Uh, tambor, tambor. Well, tambor is very cheap. Twenty thousand. Yeah. Yeah, maybe, maybe. And if I could sell my so so check this out. If I could sell my Maurice Grossman for forty thousand, then I I could get a tambor. Tambor I, and the Hublot. Purple fusion. Purple fusion. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Two piece combo. Mm, yeah. By the way, what happened? Two piece combo meal deal. 
two piece combo meal deal. Yeah, I, I I was going. I was so excited to because I, I thought I sold the sermon, so I was really excited to. I was gonna start searching for that purple ubla. Oh, okay. Oh, so then put it back. Oh, what, go, go back to Cloud Ken then. You said you'd buy for twelve. Oh, for twelve. Okay, but maybe I can sell it for more now. Hold on. So let me check. Okay, well, ask Cloud Ken first if he wants to buy okay. for 12, yeah. 12, 5. Good point. Good point. All right. Cloud Ken, are you out there? Cloud Ken. Dang. Okay. That could be a, a quick sale. Actually. Uh, Alex is so mean. It's 40000 now. Didn't you see it? It's a Tim, my so watch delusional went about the Grossman. viral. My watch is viral now. People can't get enough of the Grossman. It's viral. You didn't see it? It was a uh, no. I didn't see it. Show us. What, what are you talking oh, about? Oh, hold on, hold on. I'll pull it up for you. It was in the video, the latest video. Tim Maso. He was praising it. Here we go. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, look at that fierce watch. Though. Look at the polishing. It's nice. Yeah, I told you. Check this out. Here we go. Okay. Well, let me turn on the audio. Oh, this one's nice. That text nice. The patek. Oh, so thin, so nice. Yeah, that's a twenty-four hour GMT. Yeah. So nice. No, not GMT, is it? It is. It's got two hands. Are you sure about that? On the wrist. I thought yes. it was just a twenty-four. Where's the? Finally. No, no, it's not just twenty-four hours. Look, I'll turn it. Calatrava travel time 5224R. It has two time zones. Boom. Unlike previous travel times, like for example, the 5524G, the 5134, or the 5034, you can do all of the oh. setting of the time zones using the crown. And because both the travel time and the local time are 24 hour hands moving at the same speed, when you superimpose them, they stay that way and it cleans up the dial. Now you can see we have these hybrid baton syringe hands applied into- You see? Oh, wow, okay. I did not notice that when I was handling it. Wow, this is so much nicer. It, <laughs> no, now but... that you know, it completely wow. changes the game. This watch is a killer. It's a silent killer. Somebody, okay, yeah. nice. you guys better get on top of this one. Get well the supplies. Last. And this is a unique movement that only, it's a, the, it's like the latest creation from Paddock, I think. The, their latest kind of new thing that never, that's never existed. So I guess, I guess moving the, getting rid of the button that, that would action the, the second hand, mm -hmm. the second GMT hand. I guess they got rid of it to make it look nicer and more elegant. It looks really clean. It reduces yeah. the points where the water can enter inside the case, right? Improves water resistance. Mm. You can't mm -hmm. accidentally press it here. You, I, and it's so simple. You pull out the crown to the first position, and you just adjust it. You pull it out to, to second. So you pull it out to the first position, and it jumps in one-hour increments. Up yeah, or down. Does, it doesn't have a date. Oh, no, don't like it. It doesn't have a date. Who needs a date? Just... <laughs> no one. Yeah. All right. Okay. Let's see the Grossman. Let's see him. Okay. Let's see him talk about the Grossman. Watch this. Grossman is. Out of the 16 centimeters and up, but being oh, only 10.1 millimeters thick, it will easily slide under wow. the cup. So a very, very useful dress wait, watch. Wait, Tim. Automatic two times. Before, yeah. before he goes, why don't you do your own 60 minute um, sell of it and see if who, and let the chat vote who did it better. Okay. <laughs> and it'll be it'll be my sale video. Plenty of luminescence. This can be a forty thousand guys. For wonderful velvety new buck texture strap. New buck, an absolute pleasure in the hand and on the wrist. Here we go. Finally, my favorite watch of the day. Not just ha! the most favorite watch of the day. Launched there you go. Into... Take that. Take that, haters. Let me put put it on. Oh, oh shit. I... Favorite watch to get it sold quicker. They're holding on to it. You know what? It's not for sale. That's it. Oh, it not for sale. Oh, you guys heard it. Not for sale. Where did I leave it, though? Um... Okay. <laughs> Don't even know where it is. Well, at least play the video before you leave. What are you doing? Oh. Here, all right. Hold on. You guys want a new background? Let's make him solo layout. Oh, too slow. Too slow. 
It's also for you, Mathis. Where you can. Hey. Uh... All right, let's see I'm this. Back. I'm back. I'm back, baby. All right, here we go. Boom. I took it with me to Jacksonville. Just That's what I was saying, up. Buckley. That's what I was saying. <laughs> Buckley says hardest ones to sell. Come on, man. No, he actually likes it. It's a beautiful watch. Look at that. It doesn't need help selling. I'm not selling it. People don't want to buy it. That's you know what? That's their loss. <laughs> you know? I really, really don't care. I love this watch. Oh my god. It's it's so okay. Let's watch Tim Mossel. You guys respect Tim Mossel. He's he's the OG. 2021 in steel, the 41 millimeter Moritz Grossman Tremblage with a dial made of German silver, an alloy of nickel, copper, and zinc. You can see the copper giving it that wonderful champagne hue. Mm -hmm. The texture, the equivalent of a trembling hand applying a sharp granular finish. Historically, that's what tremblage is. Mm -hmm. And this rustic look matting the natural shine of the German silver, and no two will be exactly alike. The made in Germany, Moritz Grossman name, the track for the minutes, the seconds, the Breguet style, Arabic numerals, all of these are part of the dial. They are raised and relieved as the material is reduced. And so we have this incredible three-dimensional tremblage dial, the hands from Moritz Grossman made in-house, cut, polished, beveled and fired to create that lovely rich blue and extended super narrow almost syringe like aesthetic you can see their centers are polished and the head of the canyon pinion mounting the minute hand has been yeah it's... yeah the hands are nice yeah they are nice i told you i told you it's nice almost syringe like aesthetic you can see their centers are polished the, the center of uh of uh, where the hands are look at those connections right they're finished to such degree even on the rolex it's some some of them yeah. the can, the you, can you hear those kids oh what can i hear yeah you, a little yes just now jesus christ what are they up they're fucking in the courtyard. tell them to stop yelling and get on the strap polished and the head of the canyon pinion mounting the minute hand <laughs> has been polished you can see the sophistication uh, of the case which funny. is about 49 millimeters from lug to lug and then the way these set is unique uh -huh. so you can see the second sand okay oh damn. is in motion i pull out the crown now when i pull it out i hack the seconds so you can see that stopped the enormous variable inertia balance which is made in-house has stopped you know that when you pull a crown out you set the watch precisely and then you push the crown in and the minute hand always moves so what was the point of synchronizing so precisely well when you pull this crown out it snaps right back in and then to release the movement and resume timing you just press this return spring button on the side and now without any movement of the minute hand it resumes keeping time on the back mort's grossman caliber 101 it stand out anyways anyways it's uh it's a pretty cool watch something special you know something different something that's a little bit more handmade than the standard well so hopefully hopefully you should be able to sell yours soon then you no, i'm not also. trying to sell it I, I'm, not, I'm not selling it i mean unless somebody wants to buy it for forty thousand, i'm not selling it that's buckley do you hear this madness forty thousand now yeah, oh yeah on. i raised set him straight Forty thousand. tim you're a flipper you're not a collector bro you're a fucking flipper i'm, not a flipper. Fucking flipper. I'm a collector Timbo is a collector and a hoarder. Hoarder is a better word, not a collector. Yeah, no, I, I saw a lot of stuff. I'm sell, I'm quietly selling a lot of the other things that I was interested in. I'm selling a lot of collectible books that I had. You're going to sell the summer to Cloud Ken? Cloud Ken? Yeah, if Cloud Ken is... Yeah, we need to get in touch with him. When we, when you see him next time in the chat, let him, let him know. Uh, I, I think put, I'm put it on the banner. Put it on the banner. Put it on the banner. Just on put it banner. on the banner. Yeah, to say Cloud Ken, reach out to me for, for the sermon. Ah, it's okay. It, it clogs up the screen. Uh wristwatch holic 40k. That's right. If 
that's if you want to buy it. If you don't want to buy it, then it's a, it's fine. Nobody. That's the cool thing about watch collecting is that you don't have to buy and you don't have to sell. Whoever's telling you to buy or sell, no, it's your decision. Final, final, your final decision is yours. Wait, I I can tell them to fuck off. Uh, but you don't have any watches, so. <laughs> Buckley says I want fifty k for my Pepsi. Yeah, but Pepsi, it's uh, it's different. There's actually a lot more of them on the market. Right, Pepsi, there's there's so many. There's a sea of Pepsis. But uh, with the mortgage Grossman, there's only a few. But you know, uh, there's no demand for them. And but there's a lot of demand for the Pepsi. It is what it is. But anyways, that's why. That's why. Look. Imagine, imagine if Moritz Grossman had the unlimited money that the Louis Vuitton has, right? Because Louis Vuitton, I mean, this is serious stuff. I mean, look at this. This is even more close-up images on monochrome. Oh, that's nice. Although it doesn't yeah. look, looks kind of messed up right now, but what's well, messed up? There looks all scratched up and shit. Oh, uh, where, where? Well, it's just. It's a little dirty. It's not scratched up. Come on, man. It's fine. Uh, uh oh. Hey, Tim G. Hey, I'm here with my favorite person, Kimbo and Small G are my two. And Cam, how are you? Doing? Yo, what's going on? Hey, how are you? I actually like this watch. You like it? Which yeah. Which one? Yeah. The gross, the gross oh, one or the Louis? I set the YouTube off. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm a, there I am better. The Louis Vuitton or the, the Grossman? Believe it or not, the Louis Vuitton. Ah, yeah, see, yeah, yeah. we both like it. But can you guess the price of this? $480,000. Close. 200, right? Was it two, like 200? Uh, I wouldn't touch it. I would rather get an RM or a, a Group of 4C. Well, I think they're trying to compete with the RM. They're just, they're, I mean, and it's a good, good competitor. Like, I agree. I, I agree. I agree. You know what? It's, it's, yeah, it's, it's nice. They did a nice job. Let's just put it that way. I wouldn't buy this. It's a little bit too ornate for me, but they did a nice job. Yeah. RM made a few pieces like this as well, right? They, they're fair. They did, uh, like a helmet of a spaceman or something, right? They had also, Sam and Rogers. also, they also uh, who was it? Zuckerberg's at the wedding. The the guy from India who was a billionaire. Mm -hmm. um, he he had a watch similar to the one on the left with the fish. Oh, the koi pond. The koi pond, and, and then Zuckerberg said, "Yeah, I like watches now." You oh. see, did you, you didn't you didn't see that, did you? I I think you sent you sent it to me. Yeah, not a big deal. Not a big Zuckerberg. deal. Zuckerberg's uh, wedding, just Zuckerberg regarding watch, watches. If you Google that, it might come Yeah, up. Zuckerberg regarding watches. Oh, uh, Anton. Anton Ambini? Cam. Uh, it was a wedding. Smacking your really keyboard. Cool. It was a wedding. Okay. Uh, no worries. Okay, no, no if, you, if you have a link, I'll. Yeah, I'll find it. I'll find it sooner. I'll I'll find it. Anyway, uh, nice watches. Yeah. Hey, your Grossman. I guess uh, OC was mentioning there was one for yours was is going for like thirty four thousand dollars someplace. Yeah, well, I know mine. Actually, the thirty thousand that I was selling it for was actually a really good deal. Um, for, for thirty, I guess, but you know, I, I hate was to, a great deal. Now it's forty thousand, by the way. I raised. I, I hate. I hate to tell you this, but you know, I've got a house listed for nine million dollars. I won't, won't sell for. Won't sell for seven. So we here in Georgia, up, huh? Excuse here me. Here in Georgia. No, no, not in Georgia. Um, oh. I don't own anything in Georgia to get camp, but I am. Yeah. I'm there all the time because my girlfriend's there. Nice. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You like so, Atlanta? Yeah. Lo love Atlanta, though. What What Actually, do you like the most? Oh, you, what do you like the most about Atlanta? Believe it or not, they have really good restaurants, and oh, yeah? people are people are 
are really friendly and cordial. They, they, they don't have anything up their butts mm -hmm. like the Northeast. Mm -hmm. What? We don't have things up our right. What are you talking about, Tenji? No, you, you're a whole, we're a whole, you're a whole different breed. You're normal. You're normal. Usually they're up pretty uptight people from the Northeast. Okay. Click on the second link. That, uh, that link has actually the, the watch it. The second link? Oh, there's a link? Yeah. There's yeah. links. Private chat. New York Times. New York Post. New York Post. There we go. New York. That's Post. it. That's it right there. Scroll there down. You go. Scroll down. Hold on. Half a screen is like an ad. Mark Zuckerberg wife goshes over Indian billionaire's Anant Ambani $1 million watch at pre-wedding party. I, I might want that. Thank you. Thank you, Kimbo, for finding that. Which watch was he wearing? Scroll down. There it is. Oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah. Richard Mille Koi Park. Now, now Zuckerberg wants one, so he's now in the game. Wow. Yo. There you go. See? I don't know. I, I think I like Louis Vuitton's version better. This is. Oh, this, you know, no, I'm sorry. I think Richard no, Mille is better. I like the Louis Vuitton better. No, oh, I like Isn't that interesting? I'll take the Richard. I take the Richard Mill. Aram and you did the wig. What do you guys think? Let's let's see it. See, it. put a poll on. That's all right. Let's, that's okay. Yeah, everyone can be. You know, we did the like koi that. pond better, right? At the fall. Well, no, I think there's a. You can't ask that. I, if if you ask me, Richard Mill did it better, but I think the Louis Vuitton looks better. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. I know they're sort of the 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 motif is. I hate to say this, you know, they're kind of the same, don't you think? It's like they just stuffed fish in on the dial for the Richard Meal, and then they had it on top of their skeletonized dial. Yeah, but I think aren't those fish swimming though? I'm just kidding. If, uh, if they were swimming in water, that'd be pretty cool. But... Remember, this is a picture. In reality, those fish, they're like swimming in there. Yeah. Between all the parts, they're going in between all the gears. gears. <laughs> so cool. Every time you look down, they're in a different position. They're moving in and out of frame. See, would, those... you pay, would you pay a million dollars for that watch? No, definitely not. I wouldn't I either. I'd rather have three watches of a million dollars in that watch. Yeah. See, the, the Richard Mill fishes look like gold fishes versus the Louis Vuitton ones. They actually look like koi. koi That's fish. exactly correct. So you want you want the goldfish watch or you want the koi koi watch? Mm. I'd rather have the Richard Mill. That's me though. Now you've got weird taste. Between the two, I I would take the Richard Mill. Yeah, well, you but... like the, you like the hype too. No, it's just I think the Richard Meal is just better. It's better quality. It's just I'm just saying to me it looks I like the Richard Meal better of this one. The but Richard Meal has goldfishes. It's huh? goldfishes. They look like goldfishes. They don't I like, like it. it. Yeah, I, I like it. I still like well, it, even if it's goldfish. I, I think it's got a leaf there. It's got I like how it's 3D dimensional. Uh, you got the fishes, and they're in the water, so you have to imagine the water is where the movement is. Uh, whereas it's on, it's engraved on the on the Louis Vuitton. Yeah, I, I yeah, I like the fishes more. This is they did Spider Man in a similar way, where it's where it, the. Oh, I love it. I actually, you know what? I didn't like that Spider Man with the AP, but now I like it. Yeah. I actually really like it. And it's going through. It's, it's 3D. They're playing with the perspective. But look in the back in the back they and, and the reverse side too. It's all three. Yeah, it's exactly LV is the second best though. It, LV is second best. The, the LV is the one I like se second the most. Like there's no other. Nobody else is competing at such a high level. Very interesting. Very nice. Yep. So uh, he he's into watches now. If you read the article, oh yeah, so what? yeah. So I, I call him Doctor Evil. <laughs> oh yeah, you she she, she is actually she's actually a Harvard grad that's a a, a, doc, a doctor doctor medical doctor. Mm -hmm. Should medical. we do a live stream and uh, and ask him to join us to talk about watches? What do you think? Yeah, and, and, and tell him to <laughs> clean up. Yeah, what is, what what does he own? He owns Facebook, right? He owns Meta. What is Meta? Oh yeah, Meta. He Meta. Owns, he owns all social media. He's gonna skew. He's gonna skew the election against. Trump. I heard he was criticizing Apple's uh, Apple Vision. Oh, interesting. Okay, I don't know that. I don't know. 
I don't know that. No, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know Zuckerberg at all. Never met him. Never. Don't want it. Don't have no intentions. Scary guy. Uh, Mark Zuckerberg just keeps dumping on Apple Vision in the Friday Post thread. The Meta View Exchange just with Mosaic Venture Partner Benedict Evans calling out the trade offs. Apple VR headset that is in this group. Your, your, mic's your audio, your audio, is messed up. Your, your audio is in and out. Why is it in and out? I'm not doing uh, anything. No, that's what she said know. too. But it's in and out. Okay. Well, anyways, uh, Zuckerberg <laughs> in uh, basically said that Apple's three thousand five hundred dollar uh, product, uh, basically uh, Apple Vision, is worse. He was said it was worse than his. Uh, meta goggles for for five hundred. But he just okay. said they're, they're not getting value. If you're buying Apple, you're not getting value. Are you? Are you? I do you think those things will do? I I think the, the first generation. I think they're they're kind of lame. I think they've got a long way to go to clean that up. No, I think it's a it's just an idea that sounds cool, but in practice, it's stupid. Because because all these guys see it. Let me explain. Most people, most normal people, want this for uh, for enjoyment. They want it to like explore other places, maybe really maybe watch a movie, right? Like or play a video game. Like, like why would somebody want goggles like this? What? Why do people want it? They would want it to to do three D shit. That's cool shit. But the, the but Apple is making this shit to do work. It's like, oh look, you can you can you can have your spreadsheet in 3D. It's like, what the hell? I don't want my spreadsheets in 3D. I want to watch the movie in 3D. And there's no movies. There's only spreadsheets and forms and and just work. It's annoying. You, you know what I mean? These guys are who are they making this for? Yeah, I agree. I agree on that. I, I, I just I can't see it. I think it's just people running away from reality. That's what it's really there for. But but the thing is the, the they're like running if you away, want to run if you away wanna... from reality, but these sons of bitches putting people back into reality, they're putting them back at work. So somebody wants to escape this freaking dredged world and they think, okay, I'm gonna go into this 3D world and play some video games. They put it on, and it's like, no, it's more work. I don't know. It's like if you want to, if you wanted to. Did you date, see the like, presentation? It was all about work. Like, oh, how look at this! You can have three screens now. Apple. Okay, look. I'll show you. It's like their advertisements. Like, look how much work you can get done. You know how you couldn't put that fourth monitor in your house? Well, now with the power of Apple Vision Four, you can have. 10, 10 monitors, unlimited oh. monitors because it's all three dimensional. It's it's insane. Okay, wait, wait. Is there an advertisement? Oh, they took it down. Okay, that was during the presentation. Okay. It's, you know, it's the, the, the Apple, that Apple Vision Pro is just too bulky. It just got too much stuff. Going no, it, on. It's garbage. It's not. Okay, okay. Look, 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 look. Let's, let's go to the first review was this one, the Marcus. What is here? Okay, the truth. All right. So here he's showing how how it looks inside. Okay. Did he like this? No. He... Well, I don't know. I don't know if he liked it. And it's because like because I, I personally think if he did, he's getting paid by them. Oh, he's definitely getting paid by them. So he's showing here. Look how you can look at the website here. See, there's there's notifications you got over there. All right. It's like, hey, there's the schedule. There's the list. Okay, would it's buy, a net. Would you, would, you, would you buy one of these? No. Okay. It's the yeah, stupidest yeah, thing ever. Yeah, I, I, there's no, there's no like really good reason. Hey, okay, they got chess. Wow. And I then mean, if, if you're gonna, if you're gonna say you're gonna date like Emma Watson or something like that, I might, look, consider, might consider it. Look, it's like, hey, look, you can open your computer desktop on it. Like <laughs> what? Okay. And it's the same as 
on the screen. Like my screen looks exactly like like that screen. I I just I think it's. I mean, it was. This is an age thing. I think even for you now, it's an age thing. I hate to say, it, you're getting too old too. I don't I want. Mean, it's just not. I think what it goes I want. down to like an 18 to 24 year old or 14 to 24 year old. This is for them. This is a whole different gig. It's just not what I want. This is not what I want to use this thing for. Like this thing would be cool. Oh, look, you could be editing videos in it. Yeah, in the in the chat, Gorilla Time. Yeah. The Gorilla Time said the two billion uh, lost on an Apple car. I think they scrapped that. They were going. They're trying oh, yeah? to produce an electric car. They scrapped it. Jeez, they, really? Oh, that's too bad. Apple could have become like. Look at Tesla. <laughs> Tesla. Is Elon Musk is taking that car down the drain? Apple could have actually maybe done it the right way. Oh, I'm, I'm an Elon Musk butt boy, so don't even go there. It's just I heard it's not doing well, man. It's oh not, well, it's, it's not doing well. But the K car, the K car, which is their cheapest model, is the number uh -huh. one seller in the, in the world. So it's doing okay. fine. Oh yeah, it's doing fine. It's it's the number one. It's the number one car in the world. He's losing sales in China because China's got stuff that's cheaper. And eventually China is going to have is, is really his competition for EVs. It, unfortunately, it's the wave of the future. I personally, they're not there yet for me because I like to drive like 16 hours a day if I'm driving. Like I'll go from I'll go from, I'll go from the East Coast to like Georgia in a day. By driving with my dog. Uh, yeah. Get me Five dollars super chat vision pro is only a concept product. It will yeah. go mainstream when it features transparent OLEDs like the latest Lenovo concept. Yeah, I don't know. It's just I don't I don't know if it's going to succeed. I, I used to I used to be a big believer in the whole three D reality stuff. I uh, I thought it would be incredible. Well, I, I even I hate even hate to say this, but the Apple 15, which I do have, by the way, yeah, because I usually trade phones in every every two steps, so 13, 15, 17, and my kids needed one, and they had the they had the 12, so they they had to do it. All they really did was upgrade the camera. They didn't have, they didn't do anything else on the 15. They they has they stopped upgrading iPhone since uh, Steve Jobs died. It's only gotten worse since. Then. In, in my opinion, I tend to agree with you. Yeah. In my opinion, I definitely agree with you. And they, yeah. So, um, uh, you, you know, I don't know how more they can progress. I mean, obviously, things are going to get faster and better and stuff like that. But I don't know how. how uh, no, there is actually ceiling with the speed as well. You would think that, you know, really? that, yeah. I think we're we're pretty much re reaching some kind of thresholds here. Well, I, I've got to I've got to tell you again. I'll say this a million times. I've got, I'm using a Chromebook right now. It cost me 135 bucks. Mm -hmm. Take it everywhere, mm -hmm. and for media, yeah, I mean for like exactly, for, it's unbelievable. You can get most of your stuff done with um, very well, little processing. Yeah, and and now. you can hear my mic and everything else. I mean, yeah. I don't know. I haven't used the camera yet. I mean, I've used the camera on Zoom and on on um, Microsoft's deal. I forget what it was, was called, but anyway, the um, but it's phenomenal. It's outstanding, and it, it's they've done a great job for. And I take I've taken it. I took it to Europe. I took it everywhere. One hundred thirty five bucks. Bought it on Amazon. Had a little chip in. They were like three hundred fifty bucks, mm -hmm. and it had a little chip in it on the on the side so i said yeah i'll take that because i know i'll throw it away in two years right you know phenomenal outstanding technology this stuff's it's getting so cheap cheaper. yeah so cheap yeah and it's and really it's, good it's really good. we pretty much reached certain ceilings here with how like we don't even we don't we no longer need faster than that because i mean what do you need it for what do you need all that processing yeah uh, that's that's true i mean you would know that i uh, your that's your league. So anyway, yeah, I mean, it is just there's limits to everything. Like 4K, 8K. Like, do we really? I, I thought, hey, maybe, maybe they will keep increasing resolution till infinity. But, um, so not I, I, there actually in most cases. So with Apple now with the 15, I'll probably wait until like the 18 comes out and then I'll get another one. I mean, it, I mean, it's just, it's stupid money too for those. They're like they're like twelve hundred, fifteen hundred dollars, depending on what size megabyte you get for the for the 
But that's that's stupid money for a stinking phone, even though it is a computer. I get that. Yeah. But that's a stupid money. So yeah, I bought two for my kids. I bought one, bought one for me, and then and then in the office because everyone has a, and it's like a perk in the office. I bought all twelve of the employees an oh. Apple phone too, fifteen. So oh wow, whatever. yeah, very nice, very nice. iPhone fifteen. Roommate wants to upgrade. Uh, she has like iPhone nine, I think. Oh no, that's time. I hate to tell you that. I'm surprised <laughs> her battery's still living. <laughs> it was my old one. Uh, so, oh, okay. Yeah. yeah, she needs I, it. You know, I I don't know what pro, what plan you have, but like like ATT, I'm sure they all have them. No, you pay by the, you pay by the month. No, no, I have the I have the Metro PCS, so I have to buy up front. Oh, okay, Eight, that's exp- well, that's expensive. Cash. Yeah, that's expensive. Cash. So I, have eight, up. I, have eight, I have AT&T, and basically, mm-hmm. I just pay monthly. It's like I don't know, thirty bucks, twelve bucks, fifteen bucks, depending on what the phone is. Mm-hmm. No, I get it. I understand. Yeah, no, I I like to because it's uh, like this the whole plans, I. I always get scammed. Like I, those those plans, phone plans, never work for me because there's always some kind of a catch. It never works out the way it's supposed to because it's it's got like ten lines of uh, subscripts, uh, and if you read if you read carefully, it turns out that by the end of the plan, you have to like return your firstborn child to them. It, yeah, I, I return them to them, but I'll wait. I'll wait until the eighteen comes out. I actually, yeah. I actually, the AT and T. I've had them for like twenty years, and I know I'm getting ripped off, but it's fine. I pay for my kids, my two kids, and myself. My two kids are that who are in their mid twenties, so um, it's going to be interesting to see how long I pay for this. My son said I want to pay for it. I go, dude, you can't, you can't afford this yet. You, it's, anyway, it's three hundred bucks. It's close to three hundred bucks plus mm-hmm. and minus twenty bucks a, mo- a month. It's not that bad. No, no. I don't have a home phone anymore. I don't have TV anymore. Yeah. There's no need to. T- you need internet, so the places I have, I have internet. That's about it. You know. Yeah, I actually, I need to change my internet plan. I need to downgrade it because uh, I've got some letters, and uh, right now I'm paying like eighty bucks for the internet. Oh, but, that's not bad. But I can. Chattanooga, yeah. I have a satellite. I pay one eighty for Hughes. Because they don't have anything in that area, mm-hmm. and then um, in Massachusetts, I pay one hundred seventeen dollars for a for a corporate. It's really fast, mm-hmm. and then in Florida, the place is being renovated. But I found out it's like one hundred four dollars in Miami. Oh, it's wow. being renovated right now. One hundred four for the internet, for the just the internet. But I have the fa- what kind of speed are we talking about? One hundred four for what? One terabyte? Yeah, exactly. Okay, because that's like kind of what I'm supposed to have. It's like it's like 800, I think, megabytes by 600 reality. When I do the test, let's see, internet. But you know, believe it or not, I watch that stuff all the time because uh-huh. they, it's nickel and diming. But they have mark what I call market creep. They every like quarter or month they raise it like two bucks or five bucks. It drives me nuts. Uh-huh. Have you noticed that they just like raise it? Yeah, by a couple of cents here and there. Yeah, exactly. So I don't that's trust him. That's why. And I, Verizon, it's impossible to reach him. Anyways. That's the other reason why I like AT&T. You can, I mean, uh, I hate the plug companies, but I, I can call them and I get, a, I, get a, I get a person who speaks English uh, immediately. Mm-hmm. It's one of the few, few lines like Comcast, all these other places. Yeah. It's just a pain in the neck. And then they want you to pay by portal now. My secretary oh does that. Oh, my God. The, the app on, on Verizon it doesn't work. But anyways, listen, listen, listen. It's it's impossible. But I'm going to change. Because you saw it, the speed that it was ridiculous. I don't need that much speed. So I'm, I'm going to downgrade it to like 300 by 200 for 30 yeah, bucks. Oh, that's, that's cheap. Yeah. That's cheap. Exactly. So. Well, I think I think personally, if you showed your t- tax returns in, in New York, you can get like for the free utility time. bills, you can probably get some sort can of get dis- poverty uh, free. Yes, interest? yes. You think I'm kidding? I would do it. Yeah, yeah, okay. I would do it I, for yeah. utility bills. You pay, you pay heat. You Next a, time you I go to the food stamp office, I'll stop by uh, and check. What do they call those cards? I forget. But the Medicaid. 
Yeah, you can probably get one of those too. Medicaid, why not? Medicaid. Why, 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 sign up for everything. Why not? Why exactly. Not? I mean, it's money not spent. It was money wasted. Absolutely. Absolutely. Hey, what do you think about the Aventis? Is this the EBT of the wristwatch world? So who? Someone's got this in our community. Is it? Is it? Is it? Who's got this in our in our community? One of these type of watches in our community. Uh, oh yeah, we we do have a one one viewer. One I haven't viewer. seen him around in a while. It's been yeah, he's been missing in action. I Who think is that? Who is that? By the, it's been by so the long, I don't remember. <laughs> he's, been, he's been gone for so long, I don't remember. Uh, I think I think he got trolled for the for the watch so hard, he's never come back. It's like these guys are vicious. That's uh, yeah, it is what it is. Uh, it's, it's, a, you know, it, it's kind of awkward on your wrist, I think, you know, but it, it's, it's actually not that bad. I tried it on. I swear. I, when I was in Dubai watch week, these guys were there. They wanted to come on the live stream, but yeah, you, I want them on the live stream? you want me to bring them on? Let's do it. Yeah. You should bring, you should bring them on. Hey, weren't you supposed to bring someone on last yesterday? I was. What do you mean? Yeah, uh, uh, whatever. Whatever. This uh, sorry, I brought something up. I should, probably should. Oh uh, yeah, no, tell me who. I don't know. I'm, this is my third scotch, so after the fourth one, I'll really start screaming. Okay. All yeah. right, drink that. Drink that third. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, yeah. Get a. Keep going. Maybe I'll I'll get a refill. So maybe somebody wants to buy me a refill. It's Sunday. Today is the Oscars, but we're going to talk about the Oscars tomorrow, guys. Because I want to review it, and we're gonna do like the Oscars special. We'll review all the winners, and we'll see what they were wearing. So I, 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 I would buy. Yeah, thanks, Gorilla Town. Thank you. The, the, um, the. Um, this is not a bad watch. I wouldn't buy it for me, but this is not a bad watch. Yeah, I wouldn't buy it, but it looks pretty cool. It does. Yeah, I wouldn't. I uh, yeah, I wouldn't buy it, and I wouldn't recommend you buy anyone else buy it. But uh, if you bought one, then it's not that bad. It's there well, are worse I'm watches. I'm starting to realize that my watch taste is totally fucked up because I only like like the Holy Trinity now. Yeah, it's not. It's not good. It's not healthy. But, the, it's, but it's okay not to like this brand. It's look at it. It's fugly. It's totally fine to not like this. Yeah, but Tim G, your your tastes are boring. Expand your taste. Yeah, I know. I know. I'm boring. Louis Vuitton made the same watch for a million dollars. But theirs is circular. It looks so much nicer. It doesn't look as cheap. I think. Yeah, it is. I mean, it looks cheap. <clears throat> I mean, uh, there's this look. Like, there looks like it's no cost was spared. I mean, that looks like a swatch for Christ's sakes. That looks like a – take a look at – go to Swatch page, and they've got something similar to that. And with 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 their automatic dial for 240 bucks. okay? okay. <laughs> like a swatch. Drink okay. some more. Drink some more. Maybe it'll look better after a few more drinks. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's like a chick. But, so in any event, in any event um, I mean, come on. Come on. I mean, it's a Swatch. That's a Swatch. It's 500 grand. Oh, right? damn. Oh, no. Swatch released a new model, a new, a completely new line. They've got a, new... they've got a 48 millimeter watch. I mean, okay, that's it's huge. Look at this. That's, this is the new one. Yes. Yeah. They have these square ones now, all different colors. I mean, yeah. I was on their page. I was looking for my daughter. For, yeah, for that's a great movie. one. It's a great one. Yeah, it's good beater. Oh, yeah, baby. Look at this. The battery. You walk into the, you walk into the Swatch store, and when it runs out, you walk into the Swatch store and at, at Times Square, and they'll they'll give you a new battery. Free they, replacement. They're for, for no free. questions asked. They no don't questions. ask you what happened. How did it run out? What did you do? They just. Replaced. But I mean, they're automatic movement. They've got a forty-eight millimeter that looks pretty. Uh, it's it's big. But I like big. the design of this one. Actually. I like it too. What the. F it's good. It's really, really good. The design. It's pink too. I gotta have it. One hundred ten dollars. Yeah, let's get it. Wow. Maybe, maybe this will get me kind of. Uh, um, this, uh, it'll it's a, a whole watch until I get the. Is Uber. this your? 
is this your court substitute to the FB Jorn Elegante? No, it's my substitute for the Ublo, the purple Ublo that I will get in the future. Oh, which is a total waste of money, too. You so, could, know, you could never sell. You could never sell that. You could never right. sell the Ublo. I know. No, but that that's going to be a keeper. This one, though, I think I like the design. I actually really, really like this one. Should I order it or should I go to the city tomorrow? No, you go to the city this week and go to the city. city. Right. Yeah, and then you can then you can wear it and see if you'll really like it. Yeah, I can put it on the wrist. I can take some wrist shots. Hell yeah! Oh, no, I, I believe it or not, Swag they they've got this forty eight millimeter. Can I go? This is it's sort of wild, but I actually like it. I mean, they've got they they've got automatic movements now for two hundred and granted, it's the same automatic movement for each of their watches for like two hundred and forty bucks. Let's check out the European watch company and see what it's all about. What do you think? Yep. Uh, I, was there, I was there this morning. Oh, really? No, what? I wasn't there there. I wasn't there there this morning. I was on the website this morning. I'm in Georgia. In Georgia? Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, but let's see here. What do we have here? It's pretty good. It's pretty you know, good. I, 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 I will say this a million times. You should go and get your Grossman and have and bring that Grossman into them and switch it with a code. Oh, I'm not telling you. The Grossman is not for sale. I'm keeping okay. the Grossman because it, it's too expensive. People can't afford to buy it. So. Why? Why should I even sell it? That that, that IWC is totally overpriced. The, but hey, it looks like fears that we looked earlier today. It's totally, that should be that's a six seven thousand dollar watch. I'm no, sorry. I kind of I really dig this one. Nah, yeah, it's, it's, little... it's unsellable. It's unsellable. It's unsellable. If you were trying to trade this in, they'd offer you three. Do, it does do look not buy like this watch. Life. Do not buy this watch. Buy the fears. Buy the fears. Yeah, buy the fears. That's no, cheaper, at least, than this. Oh. If you're going to bend over, you might as well buy the fears. Okay. It's an interesting watch, though. You got to you gotta admit. Look at this. Laurent Ferrier's. They're, they keep dropping in price. Now, 29.3. That's cheaper than my that gold to, by $10,100. That, yes, that used to be $34,000. That watch, because I, I look at Laurent Ferrier, it used to be $34,000 exactly one year the, I guess European no, watch companies no. sold all the Grossmans. There's no more Grossmans on their site. They sold all the Grossmans? There you go. So, it's a hot selling watch. So I, I do agree with Small G on, on this. I mean, he unfortunately put this in my brain. This is re what's really bad with being influenced by all these all your community people. If you're buying a Laurent Ferrier, you should buy the Micro Rotor, which won the H what the, the oscars whatever it's called hg whatever it is of gphg it, thank you the, uh, whatever a b c d e f g <laughs> of the of the of the watch community you should buy the you should buy the micro rotor this this is a beautiful movement but it's not a micro rotor this one isn't keep going let's see the back no turn it around see watch it, yeah it's it's a, it's a it's like the seven it's a, like their seven day one Manual wind, it's nice. It's got that very special. It's really, it's really, really nice. But you should, unfortunately, small G. And for really, small G really effed me up on this. You should buy the micro rotor on on Lauren the, Ferrier. The micro rotor, what yeah, is which that? won the A B C D G E F G award. What what do you call that again? Oh, G -G. G -G. G -G. <laughs> yeah. uh, you know, whatever. You know, I, I. But you know what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So go to go to Laura Ferry, click on brands. Yeah, yeah. go on Laura Ferry. We'll show you what you should buy. The brands, yeah, the brands. Small G yeah. mentioned this. I'm surprised you never picked this up. It fucked me up. No, nah, Small G is very mean now. He, he's only very particular about certain brands. No, uh, he's, he's he's smart bomb. Yeah, oh, yeah. Smart, 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 smart bombs. Do the auto touch any one. Just pick that one. That one has the micro rotor. This one? Yeah. 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 So they, they make. Oh, two, yeah. Okay. They. they, they yeah, nah, sort of. Wow. Go back, go back, go back, go back to the Lauren Ferry. Go back, even the, go back, go back to Lauren Ferry. It is nice, but I, I still want keep on going, keep on going. 
Try that one. Try that green one, which I don't like the dial. I think they're all the same. I think these are all the same now. They're the same. They're not. They're not the Oh yeah, you're right. They They only sold a bunch. Okay. Yeah, I mean they sold the Grossman. Good for them. They sold the Grossman. Hey, look, Timbo. Grossman is gone. I I told you guys. Yeah. People who are sleeping on it. It's available now for forty thousand. Uh, I had it on discount for a very long time. Uh, nobody picked it up. It so now this the discount has gone away. It's now forty thousand. So if somebody's interested, reach out to me for forty thousand. These are getting sold out very quickly, and there's gonna be none no more. So so yeah, in the community chat, Red Time mentioned that that the micro rotor is the one that won the won the the ABCD G- award. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> What the hell does that stand for? GPHG. Do you know? Grand Prix Horology something. I don't know. Oh, yeah, yeah. Grand <laughs> Prix Horology of the Arts. It's like the Oscars. Of- <laughs> it is the Oscars. Let's, let's look this up, and, and actually, actually, if you sleep with the judges, you win the award. Exactly. Okay? It's all written. We know. We know. It's all right. So, but but it, it is a really nice movement there, micro. Role. The other one's a nice movement too, but they sort of bum me out when Small G mentioned that. So anyway, yeah, I have two issues now: that one and and Diego mentioning about the overseas with Bashran Constantine. That it changed too many times. That yeah. really fucked me up too. Ah, oh, interesting. It's Grand Prix, the the Orgy de Genève. When did you talk to him about this? He was on the he was on the air like six months ago talking about overseas, saying that they they their lineage, like Rolex is submariner, slowly changed, like from a 40 to a 41, super case to whatever, mm-hmm. all this other But overseas went boom and just changed everything. Yeah, well, yeah, they, they, yeah. Well, the latest iteration, the latest changes, watch. latest changes are very gradual now. Now they have the 45 to zero. Like those are now more subtle changes, so can't yeah, always get them right. I agree with you on that. I do agree with you. But anyway, that fucked me up. Okay. Are right, you guys drink more? Um, I'm gonna hop off. Yeah, I'll drink. I've got one more to drink, and I'm done <laughs> for the night. All right. All right. See you guys. Tim, are you All still right, there? Take care. Tim, are you still there? No, nah, we'll talk. So, what do you guys want to talk about? Since since yeah, yeah. All right. See okay. you guys. Take care. Bye bye. Take care, Kimbo. Mm mm mm. God, yeah. I really, I, I really like him. Kim, yeah, yeah, he's a good guy. Really good, really, really good guy. Yeah. So anyway, yeah. Uh, let's see what else. What else is going on here in the wristwatch space? Sale is pending. Look at this. This just sold. This watch right here. Yeah, Thirty-one day power reserve. I wouldn't buy it. There's too many watches in that price range. Oh my God! Who needs? I, mean, I know. I believe it or not. I would pick a code before this. What would you rather take? I'd take a code chrono before this. Code chrono? <laughs> code 1159. Yeah, definitely. Uh, me too. Because I would like, take, Unfortunately, I, even though this is a beautiful watch. No, it's not. It's huge. It's, well, that's a, it's a hockey puck or hamburger. Yeah. On your wrist. It's a double Big Mac. But the thing is with these watches, people tend not to wear them, so... Down the road, they're always pristine. That's fair. Yeah, you only then, probably wear this to a red bar, or right. So for, si- for so for six months, for six months, I've been craving for the Saxonia, um, uh, Lange on Saxonia, um, thin with the two hander. And now I don't know, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Lange Saxonia, yeah, don't, don't right, I need, I need a beat. I need a beater. Yeah, believe it or not, my beater is between twenty and thirty thousand. Twenty to thirty thousand. What? Then I don't. I don't. I, Get and the I don't Louis Vuitton tambour. Nah. Come on. Nah. Be the pioneer. Nah. Why not? Nah. You could be nah. a leader and not a. Nah, leader. It's think a designer. About it. Designer. Why? No, nah, I gotta stick with the Holy Trinity. It doesn't have yeah, to. I'll probably, go va- I'll probably go back. Va- I'll probably go Vacheron. I, pr- I was looking at the. I know you're going to say. Uh, I was looking at the Vacheron. Um, complete the complete calendar traditional. Co- complete calendar. Because I want a. I want a moon face, even though people hate. Sure? Look at this. Look how amazing this. Uh, look at this yeah. advertisement, uh, Tim. 
Look, this is like you. That guy looks like you. No, he who is he you're, meeting? You're dreaming. A, gr- a really nothing. sexy girlfriend. Yeah. No, I was sorry, me. And he brought her a watch. You know what? Uh, Rat Town, totally the Bremont I like. He's but a the player. Problem is, this guy is a player. It's, it's not, they're not worth the money. The, the, it's not worth the dough. It's not the uh, the Type 20 is just not worth it. I can't see paying. It's a good looking watch, but no, nah, I don't like bracelets. How do you like that no, one? No, 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 no. Well, you might be. And you know what? That's an integrated bracelet. Yeah, it's a good looking watch. It's it's different, you see? It's different, Tim. You know, all these watches are looking alike now. They got the, the small seconds. They got the little micro rotor. I mean, this is Lauren Ferry. The design here yeah. is above and beyond. No, I like Guilloche. I like Guilloche back. Okay, so that was no, but that's a Guilloche. Look at that's a very special, unique LV pattern Guilloche that they invented just for the Louis Vuitton. You see that? That pattern is the Louis I, Vuitton. I can't, I can't. I can't wear a, a dial that has Louis Vuitton on on the watch. I can't do it. it but they, I, I don't know. I, you know what? Even ask one like, of your girlfriends what she thinks about it. That's what. That's what we want to know. Because if she thinks it's hot, then she, she, yeah, in all due respect, they they don't know any better. Well, we're gonna we're gonna do some testing. <laughs> they don't know. <laughs> they don't know any better. They don't know. Uh, all right. So you said five, uh, twenty thousand to thirty thousand. Twenty to thirty thousand. What would you buy? Twenty to thirty thousand. Yeah, I, I think I can get a. I think I can get a Vacheron Constantine, uh, traditional, for twenty nine five. That go for forty five thousand dollars. Almost spanking brand new. Mm, traditional. Yeah, you don't like any. You don't like that. It's too old school for you. That's really old school. That's not a great beater because very little water resistance there. Oh, I don't care about that because I'm not jumping into a pond with it or a pool. Right. I can't stand pools because people pee in the pools. I oh, and the it. chlorine, it burns. It's, I, I, so it's either an ocean or a pond. So I don't go into pools. I don't like pools. I don't like hanging around pools, even though I, you know, you like checking out everybody. I don't like pools because of the chlorine and people peeing in the pool. Or kids, even worse. Kids. Or go to, you know, I was in the pool in Dubai, took the roommate. Yeah. To she'd never been to the pool, she doesn't know how to swim, but you can teach her that. You can teach her, yeah. Oh, I was it. teaching her a I, little bit. In all due respect, she thought I was it. gonna drown her, she was so scared for that's her. Life. Fun. That's fun. I gotta tell you something. You were you were like a lifeguard, weren't you, or something? Yeah, actually, I taught her a lot. Uh, I taught her so, you know what? That's really good because you've got like control over. Her. So, that's how you, you get her in the pool. And then you've got like total power over her. She can totally like submit. She was so scared of of the pool. She thought I was gonna drown her. I'm, like, oh, I'm just trying to teach her how to swim, uh, and how not to be scared. It's all it's all about like if you're afraid. No, of I agree. The water, I agree. You're not gonna be able to, sli- to well, swim well, because well, you have to be relaxed. One of my close one of my closest friends when I was. Uh, one of my closest friends from college, he he lived in Santa Monica, and he was a lifeguard during the summer, there, which is like a full-time job. They make mm-hmm. a lot of dough. And I went out to Santa Monica, went out to and started to swim, and basically it was a riptide, and I oh. called him to try to save me, mm-hmm. and he just laughed. So I just treaded water for like two hours, I was, and to this day, I won't go into an ocean. Son of a bitch. The son of a bitch. But I'm a pretty good swimmer, and the the son of a bitch never would say it. And he's a lifeguard. Okay, I was out there like treading water with the riptide going going diagonal. I knew that, and it was a pain in the ass. That's a nice watch. I was looking at that today. That's That's, platinum. Yeah, that's a platinum, and with the four 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 hundred movement, which is a classic. Which is one wow. of the best manual wine movements you can buy. That's, that's the really same nice. movement that's in the Historics 1921, yeah. just not sideways. So they don't make these anymore. They they stopped making them like a year or two two years ago. It's really really nice. It's I think too expensive. This could it's be it. Huh? No, you, you said you needed a beater, 
for yeah, I need um, it. It's, right. it's, pretty, it's, it's, pretty, right. it's it's pretty damn close. I think I can get the I think I can get the um the Vacheron Constantine complete calendar traditional it looks like this with the Dolphine hands mm -hmm. twenty nine five, which is unheard of, brand new. There's a guy in Miami. I deal with two guys in Miami. There's a guy in Miami. Somehow he can get Vacheron Constantines from the Vacheron Constantine store for what they pretty much pay for, and he, he charges like two grand above. I don't know how he does it. So that's I. I I, mean, I don't know if I should mention that, but it's too late yeah. now. Wow. That's big. Now, unlike Cam. So apparently Cam, he's making like seventy-five to to ninety-five thousand. Good. Good for him. That's, that's pretty good. Yeah. Or a young, young buck getting out of school. That's great. Wow. Good for him. He's very successful. I'm proud of him. That's yeah, that's very good. I, I think he's gonna be able, you know, with that kind of money, depending on I don't know what his expenses are. Right, and if he has a lot of debt, because remember, right, he might have some kind of debt from education, right? So oh, he probably got grant. He probably got grants and stuff. This is a minority. In all due respect, nothing wrong with that. Nothing. Say. Listen, if he could, I I tried to apply for some grants. I I couldn't get anything. It's tough getting grants and scholarships. You have to be smart and and intelligent. Yeah, no, I, I totally understand. Yeah, I've, I've gone through all. The, I've, and you, I've, gone, I've done that with two kids, and I might have two more. So whatever. Hmm. But hopefully, he doesn't have a lot of debt. He's got what a car, and an apartment. He's got to feed himself. So I mean, it's, it costs money, and inflation is pretty pretty rough. Um, it's expensive out there. Every everything's expensive. It's really it's really popped within the last five years. Trooper Trooper has been member for to one to two months. The upvote is the poor man's super chat, guys. If you agree that it's tough out there, hit the upvote button. I uh, would really appreciate it. Let's get to one hundred. Good, look, good looking dog. Good looking dog trooper. Yeah, I'm a big dog fan. I don't like people, but the dogs are yeah. cool. <laughs> Yeah. What what kind of breed is that? Can you recognize? I I don't know. No, I don't. I'm not. I'm not good at like. You're good looking dog. Huh? I know. So German anyway, I, I don't know what else. Um, I I don't know what else to tell you. I don't know in the sense. You don't like this one? Point, okay. Nah, it's a little bit too simple for me. I did look at it pretty hard this morning. Uh huh. Pretty hard. Look at this. This is a, a freaking perpetual freaking calendar from Lange Unzuna for 66000 That's a lot of watch for seemingly. It's a, beautiful, it's a beautiful oh. watch. Lange has an issue. So for $66,900, I, would buy, Gee, I would buy a Patek. I would buy a Patek Aquanaut. No, this is better. Come on, fifty five hundred, fifty five thousand. I mean. This is what I'm saying. This is what's going to drive the price of the Patek five five one six five one six seven nah. down. Nah, because, because people would rather get that. People would rather have the Patek with the rubber strap than this. Look, this is completely different service prices here between this one and the Patek. Servicing this costs eleven thousand dollars. Servicing. Five one six seven cost a thousand dollars. And you always notice when when European watch company shows these watches, the big date they never show it between zero and nine. Nine. They always show it from eleven to third thirty of the Smart day. Smart so, move because that blank yeah, window. That, that, that would oh, be okay. so, on this. The first thing you look at is not the time. You look at the date. Mm hmm. I mean, it's a beautiful watch. Lange makes beautiful stuff, but nah. It's the watch that you really like, but no one will buy them. Hmm. What do you think of that statement? Um, too many pushers on the side, too. Yeah, well, it's it, every single function can be controlled by a press of a pusher. It's a it's a, it's a water disaster. Uh, I, I think it's it gives you a lot of flexibility to be able to adjust everything without having all the little buttons protrude out the sides. 
or having to rely on the crown exclusively like it is a beautiful watch yeah it's a gorgeous watch it's really clean too but like for 69.3 i don't know i don't know you're you're, really you're, you're, you're you you can get you can get you can get for 95 to 105 you can get um boston's rm boston's rm is a great beater that's the kind of beater you should get yourself Let's see it. What do we got here? What kind of beater can we? Yeah, use? I I like the I like the gold Aquanauts better. No, 51, no, no. 5196 or the no, no. no. It, it, his watch is is absolutely gorgeous. It's the perfect RM actually. Don't do that. Uh, Boston Collectors uh, RM is perfect. Right. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. It is because the simplicity. Yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah. It, it's it's. It's so pure that it's it's perfect. Yeah. Uh, I mean, once you get complicated, really too complicated, it gets bad. It gets bad. You don't want Cartier because you can never sell them their beautiful watches. You you really don't want Pams. They're beautiful watches, but you just don't want them. You're done with Pams, right? You won't buy another one. No, no, I'm done. I'm done. And I think like oh, we'll see. Oh, see, we'll never buy a Pam. Never. Look, sale pending. This was sold. Well, for, for for outrageous almost ten thousand. Yeah, but I bet you that's like a fifteen thousand dollar watch. It's a GMT. Oh shit. And it's in titanium. It's cool as fuck. And it's got Brooklyn Bridge on the back. Get Great. the F out of here. European watch company is a is a great secondary place. My only issue with them is wherever you live, they will charge you tax. So I can't get I can't play that game where I'm say send it up to New Hampshire where there's no tax or if you live in Wyoming or Seattle where there's no sales tax you can't play that game. So you've got to pay the you so you've got to pay this what is it in New York 7%, 8% on that. I I want this watch. I could look at this. Well, you can trade in your Pam. Uh, yeah, I would trade in my Pam. And then, and then the three thousand dollar difference, or whatever they would give for that, versus this, or the five thousand dollar difference. That's the tax that you would pay. But that's why that's the only thing I don't like about European watch company is I don't like paying tax. I I freaking love this panorama. Look, it's New York edition. It's titanium, right? It's panorama, and it's a GMT. Look, it says New York on the side. This is a great look. New York, bam, on the side. Where can I get this one? This is what I want. Well, you know, look it up. Go to Claude Twenty Four. So on the chat, buy tempo. So and it's like buy, like me. Yeah, no. go to Chrono Twenty Four. Maybe you can find more of them. Oh, on the, in the in, go to Chrono Twenty Chrono Twenty Four. Oh, okay, yeah. Let's see. Let's see. Let's let's look for it. So uh, so in the chat, wristwatch. Holic, mm -hmm. if you if you trade in your watch with European watch company, they don't have you one. have to pay the difference in cash. That cash amount is taxable. Oh, sh contact concierge. Oh, so it's a it's a it's a um, boutique edition only. It's boutique as fuck. Look at that, New York, twelve thousand seven. Is that the Brooklyn Bridge? That it is. Okay, got it. And it's like a special box too. Eight years warranty. <clears throat> Look at that. Have you ever been to the River Cafe? Cafe? Uh, Panerai or all? Oh. No, no, in, no, in no. Brooklyn. Oh it's... no, no, I haven't. Okay. Isn't that interesting? Okay. Here, there's one for sale. Look, the the one on the European watch company was cheaper. I, I think I might be able to get one in the future. I want this one. I I think I'm gonna upgrade. What do you think? Should I uh, should I upgrade my Panerai to this Panerai? Well, if you can trade yours in, yes. Yeah, yeah. That's Let's a good looking home. watch. It's a good looking watch. Wow. What is it? A 44 millimeter? 44 titanium. Can you handle? Can you handle, can you handle a 44 millimeter? In titanium? Yeah, I can. Mine is 45. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, but you don't have the you don't have the um, the crown bezel guard on, like this one. 
Okay, here we go. Poll is in the chat. Guys, should I do it? Should I upgrade my current existing Panerai to the Panerai on the screen? Check it out. Check it out. This Panerai, Panerai Luminor. Just the base model. Look at this. It's a good looking. It's a good. That's a good looking watch. It, it is good looking. That's why I think it's not. It's not going to be. A, that's a, that's a really be nice beater. That's a nice. That's a nice beater. Yeah, you want to buy it? Six thousand? No, no, I don't want six thousand. You could help me out. You can I don't do. Help I don't do. I don't do pamps. No, nah. okay, I can't wear that. It's not my there style. Enough. No, it's not, I'm, I'm not. I'm not chic enough like you are. Fair enough. I mean, it's a cool watch. Watch this. If you don't, if you don't sell your, um, if you don't sell your uh, Rolex, um, what's that? We don't sell your Rolex. Oh, by July. The sermon, sermon. The cloud sermon. can want it. If you don't sell your sermon by July first, I, I may pick July first. Yeah. Okay, I, I might hold it for you. Look at that. It's you see, that's forty four. That's a good size. In titanium, it would be lighter. It would be half the size. It's about the same size, too. Right? Look, it looks really good. I like the also, if I get fat, it's still good. It's gonna look good on me. How many watch bands do you have with that thing? Uh, I have three. Okay, I gave well, one to Buckley. Can you believe it? it? No. Well, nice. Is, does Buckley still have that watch or no? No, he sold it. I don't know. I think he sold with the with the strap. With the band too. So there you go. Is it a twenty three millimeter strap? You can't make this up because yeah, you can't was, make that up. That's Buckley though. That's good. Go I got it. somebody gave me the the straps for for the Panerai as a gift. And I didn't have a panorama. I'm like, what the fuck? Okay, so uh, and what, Buckley what? had, and so I, I, me and Buckley, we went to a panorama event. Yeah, and I I'm know. Like, That's where you bought I it. I gave those as a gift to Buckley because what's so cool. what scotch were you drinking? Delmore 25. Yeah, that's that's sweet well, scotch. Okay. Yeah. That's the and then I ended up buying Panera. I know that's fine. We and you got yeah, that's fine. It's uh, a newbie. It's a newbie thing. That's fine. New mistake, also, you're, not, in the watch, you're the watch, you're the watch person, so it's fine. Yeah. But um, I gotta be honest, I'm digging this luminor by tempo type. So you, this is an interesting conversation. So every watch you buy, because of, this is your watch industry, you should have a tax write-off of every watch you buy. Exactly. So it's an expense. Maybe I could do something like that. Yeah, it is an expense. These are expensive. <laughs> because they're expensive. <laughs> but you need the money to buy them. That's the issue. Yeah. Okay. Now, That's you know what? The Louis Vuitton is it's a beautiful watch. I don't like the bracelet that's attached. I don't like the fact that it doesn't have lugs. No lugs. Oh. Sorry about that. So let's go back to the thing. Just to go back. That's okay. fine. Okay. Let's keep on going. Yeah, it's a nice watch. Right. I like your I like your watch right. better. Though. You like mine like, better. Jeez. Yeah, I like it better. I like the two hander. Um, no, I, I like this one because it's New York. I like it. This is a great story, I think. If I ever leave New York, you'd be cool to like, hey, you know, I still got that one. Where where would you go? Would you go to Florida? I could I could. I could. Expensive. Just as expensive as New York now. Yeah. Okay. Florida. Maybe I'll go to Arizona. Or maybe Minnesota. One of the middle middle states. You know, it's interesting about Arizona, two hour difference, right? Three hour difference, two hours, depending on where you are. The you can start the live show at three. Oh, which is like five or six here. Oh yeah, and, you, and you'll have the rest of the day off. Wow. I thought I, I when I was at, when I was in my twenties, I thought about being a stockbroker in Hawaii because you could start your day at like four o'clock in the morning, <laughs> and then you're done at like noon. <laughs> nice. Uh, and then you got I thought about it, huh? Oh, I thought about interesting it. concept. Very interesting. Yeah. And Hawaii kicks ass. That's a paradise on earth if there's something. That's exactly well, you could do this in Hawaii. Um and actually the Hawaii airport you can get anywhere to you. I mean, basically, you could live in Iowa. You could do this anywhere. You it's just a matter of what roommate would want. 
Florida would be good. Because, in all due respect, Florida would be good because Rumi could easily get a job there. She'd have to get relicensed, though. That's the only problem from New York. The problem Florida. with Florida is the global climate change. Yeah, but you got that in Long Island. Be there for, you got for that time. in. I mean, you got that in the southern part of Manhattan. May not be there right. either. Well, Manhattan may, either. Exactly. Manhattan may Same not be problem. There. Exactly. Same problem. So the that's other what I was thinking. Thing maybe is one is of that, those middle like, states that could like be I always check the weather at my, up in my home in Massachusetts. They had a well. You probably did too. You tons of rain today. Ten years ago, that used to be snow. Hmm. Tons of rain. I mean, there, there was one major snowstorm so far in Boston the whole year so far. That's unheard of. Hmm. Anyway, let's go back to watches. Yeah, no. Anyways, this one is pretty cool. Let's let's see it. What do we what do we got here in new arrivals? Let's let's keep going through the new arrivals. They got interesting stuff. New pricing. Look at this one. The this is brilliant for forty five thousand. Not bad. Right, it's getting close to to the price of Mike Grossman. I can trade in Mike Grossman for forty. Add a five. Get this. Yeah, buy it. Probably. Oh, you get, no, you know what? You trade your Grossman in plus. The sermon, and he can get this. Uh, Grossman plus the sermon. Oh yeah, I think maybe that that could be a, a, a swap. I would do that for this. That would be a great swap, right? That oh, would be a good. Swap. Oh okay. shit! This one you like? No, I just remove the two and one is okay. Yeah, remove two for one. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, that's okay for this. Bring the another one. Wow. Um, Timmy, I hate to say it, that I would go for it. That's a swap. Yeah. Yeah. That's a, a, a upgrade. That's a and the, and it, it, they, upgrade. European watch company could sell the sermon all day long, all day long. Roman doesn't doesn't want me to upgrade the pad, right? <laughs> oh, interesting. Okay. Oh. Wow. Uh, let's see what else. This is a great watch. Let's see what else they got. That Boston would be happy as well. And See, believe it or not, I really looked hard at that Patek uh, too. That Patek, that black oh, hat. Huh? I know it's boring for everybody. I'm sorry. This one? I really, yeah, I looked hard, hard. That's a good price. For this that. is OC's brother bought this watch. Great price for that. You yeah. know what I like is that captain's dial. That it opens up and you you it opens up. So no, it's a it, hunter's case back. Yes, exactly. It's a, call yeah, it you captain. said captain's dial. I call I call it captain's dial. Okay. Okay. Okay, Captain's Dial, you got it. That's what <laughs> All right. we'll call it so here open, on the you open, right you open up the you open up the case back. That's all you need, and then you so you get it's the got real, a mirror in the way. So if you yeah, and you've got the, the real con, gold, you, and you've got the real gold. It's like all gold. So you 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 you've got the gold watch. I'm not. Uh, this is empty glass. So put it. What's the empty glass in your fucking? Kitchen? I wasn't. I wasn't here. Just put it in the kitchen. Sorry, roommate. I I convinced oh, you. Just 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 relax. Relax. I wasn't drinking. My God. Roommate is upset about a little bit of the blue label. My God. That's all right. It's Sunday can't. night. I I was gonna get a bottle of wine and then I forgot. Could have been no, nice. I'm I'm actually, I'm actually drinking um, Macallan 18. Oh, very nice, McAllen eighteen from the bar. From the bar here, there's no one. There's no one in the bar. Sweet at the club. Nothing good, nothing good, nothing good. Oh, nothing good, nothing good. oh, 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 oh. <laughs> okay. Anyways, this so, uh, yeah, this one is pretty cool. These are. This is actually too much. That's, this one, I think. Oh, actually, I, I think it's a good price. How do you? Uh, they used to be forty two thousand last year. Yeah, but I've seen them for. 24. All right, so I I gauge this right. by Jama Shop. If you go to Jama Shop, you'll get the uh, what what the fake what the fake price is, and if, if this goes is lower than Jama Shop, then this is a better price. I think this is a pretty damn good price. Let's see, Jama Shop, and just throw in that number. Boom. There right there. Oh, okay, no, it's higher than Jama Shop. Well, it's like you know what it is. It's a game of chicken. Each each of these companies, they manipulating prices to see who's gonna sell for lowest price Who, who's gonna who's gonna fuck me more yeah <laughs> yeah this is unfortunate thirty two thousand five. it's a lot of money thirty two thousand five. look at a jama shop too so many choices though look at like it's just 
endless sports it's, it's, out, it's out of control there's no no shot Joe Mushab is getting overwhelmed they have two oh by the way I've just played around with this watch BW had it the Seiko okay. that's actually a nice watch so here we go would you buy this or you buy the Ferris or fairy whatever it's Fer called. Fierce. Well, I think Fierce. I would buy the Fierce for four grand yeah I, I really I really like the story of the fears that uh, it's a brand that okay. that survived it's representing the the spirit right the spirit of watchmaking because like what are we buying these watches for to tell the time because look if I needed a watch to tell the time if I was starting out the collection and I wanted some cool watch I would buy this but now with knowing all that I know, I would go with the fears. I like the story of the fears. And it has personal meaning to me because it was one of the like brands I learned when I literally just first started kind of looking for videos about watches. And it stood out. That video stood out. We could actually might even be able to find it. I don't know. Anyways. Okay. Anyway, we'll go back to it so we don't jump around too much. Yeah, no, no, no. Um, oh. but you know that has a, that that they have that case back for that Seiko is that's an open case back. Yeah, here it's an open case back. Uh, by the way, this bezel, there's something really special. It's a special reflective material that's on this bezel. Uh, it's like silver, but when you turn it in the other angle, it turns black. It's like. Oh, no, from this side, see, it looks like root beer. Oh, yeah, it does. But from other, there's angles. Okay, in not, not, not in these pictures, but in real life, it could turn completely black. Yeah, and as you can see, it. that's the how's that? How's that bracelet? Jubilee, it's, it's nice. Is it? Okay. Yeah, it's a great watch. Okay. Solid watch. Good price. The complication I have a little bit issue with. There's there's some compromises <clears throat> that were done. So first of all, like the crown is not screwed down. Oh, that's bad. Yeah, but but it's good because you can pull out the crown and then the for, the first position jumps the GMT hand forward in in uh yeah in like clockwise direction. It doesn't jump it backwards. So if you're setting second uh, time zone, then your second time zone would be uh, the the GMT hand, uh, the gray hand, right? So it's like the movement is kind of, it looks like Explorer 2 movement, but it doesn't work like Explorer 2 movement. It's, that's the only kind of issue that I have with it. But other than that, the bezel is bi-directional. It's nice. Uh, the price is wild. And it, freaking looks looks incredible for the price it's incredible it's an incredible watch but it's a seiko yeah it's a seiko is actually really good i mean seiko or fears roommate what so do you think at, did, you, did you see the fears so roommate roommate has look at the fears would you buy fears instead no look 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 it's good no Four thousand dollars minus silver. She's got a Pepsi. She's not gonna buy a fierce. Even though this watch is good, I don't care. Look at that, Roman. Money for the Rolex. That's it. Rolex. You heard that? That. What about what about Louis Vuitton watches, Roman? Did you see the new Louis Vuitton watches? Look, look at the new Louis Vuitton. No. Why not? Look at this. Cute, no. It's really cute, though. Okay. The roommate has spoken. So that's like the sentiment of like 80% of all people. You just have to listen to people like that to get your sentiment on watches. Okay? Mm. Yeah, watches are cool. I like watches. So the one on the, one on the left, that's all the, all, the, the Louis Vuitton. That's all... That's clear. Oh, come down, come down. Swatch. 
A swatch? With a swatch. Anyway, let's keep on going with you. Yeah, I, I think I, I think I might uh, I might get that I might get that swatch, that square one. Good. Yeah. I'm telling you, they, I looked at these too. So double D wow. has a that I really like. It's that with the white dial. Look at this. Oh really my try. god. This is yeah, double D, but in blue. Yeah, exactly. I Dare I say that. this is better? Can but, could he get himself an upgrade? This will. This is a great watch. It's it's still old, but it's blue. Old, old school, but they 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 changed it. They modernized it. Let's put it. They that modernized way. it. It's like a BMW. <laughs> yeah. I actually like it. It's I like looked at this refurbished too BMW or like yeah. one of those Singer Porsches nine one one. Yeah. And what do they want for this? Oh, not nothing. Very cheap. Twenty-two five. Yeah, it's not bad. Yo, I think, double, I double D. D. Double D. I think paid like seventeen or eighteen thousand for his. At, at um, he should trade his my, in, add a shader nah, with it, nah, and nah. get this. It's worth the. Upgrade. I like double D's taste because it's my taste. It, so his it's is awesome. more tasteful and more classy, but he's got other. He's got Breguet that is also oh, no, classy. I he doesn't know, need all classy watches. He could have a little bit of variety. This yeah, he's be got, fun. He's got, unfortunately, or fortunately, he's got my taste. So, yeah, unfortunately or fortunately, it depends on who you are. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Some people don't like it. Why they don't like it? Why do you guys don't like it? Because it's a, it's a um, it's a I, I like watches with bands, not with braces. Toxic sludge. Yeah, there you go. So I like the, the longer the deeper one. The Saxonia, that's the one that nobody likes because you see the date doesn't have a zero. Oh, did they put the oh, no zero? Look at that. They didn't they 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 should have put the they should have changed the date on the thing when we they caught them. It. See, they fucked it up. Yeah, this not, never, that's why it's so cheap. It's twenty two five. It's act that's a good price, but I would still not buy it. That's a good price for that. Yeah. But the problem is is <laughs> yeah. that what do you think? What do you think is that a deal breaker? Does it look uh, asymmetrical? No, no, it's okay. Once, so it's like for nine, one to nine. Yeah. Zero. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, but that can, that could drive a person insane. Oh, that look at it every single day. That number, that blank space, mocking you, laughing at you for like, nine day for nine days for nine days. Okay. <laughs> All right, that would drive me crazy. <laughs> you could, he's gonna end up in an asylum. Yeah, hey, absolutely. Like he has to a, do something quick. I'd be in a straight jacket with that watch. <laughs> okay, that would drive me crazy. Okay, because uh, it's the first thing you look at at that watch. Yeah, it's. I gotta tell you, I had to take it off the screen. It's. If you're gonna put crazy. a big date on it, just put a zero there, I, and they will never, they never will because of that. Look, if I bought one, I would take it to a watchmaker, unauthorized watchmaker, and had a zero painted in. <laughs> yeah. And a zero. I don't be, care. And when, when you say, whoa, what is that? Zero one? How, how did that happen? I said, I took it custom. I couldn't handle it anymore. <laughs> I don't care that, that, that Lange <laughs> decided that it's going to be a blank. I want the zero there, and I, I put a zero. I haven't put a Sharpie zero there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The Bulgarian, no, the Breguet, yeah, Breguet, yeah. this one, good yeah, this is sexy. Good looking watch. Let's see what the reverse looks like, though. It's a hard cat case back, though. Oh my god, it is white gold. I would take that. You'd like this one, it's 34. Oh. It's for a lady, yeah, it's for you. No, I good looking watch. Why you need 40? This is cute, no, it's good it. size, it's white gold, so it's heavy. Good looking watch. It's a great look at the green box. Yeah, Oh my God! This is great for a roommate, guys. If you have a roommate, you were looking for a perfect watch for her. What a what a great choice! Or if you have small wrists, this could be also a great choice for a man. Uh, let's see what else we got no, here. For the, for the roommate, this one. This one. This one. This one. Which one? This one. What is that? Oh, the Yachtmaster Thirty Seven. Hold on, hold on. Keep it there. Right there, boom. Yeah, if anybody good looking, that's really a good looking watch. 
That's mm. the ideal watch for your wife. Right. Then you buy the four. Hey, roommate, you want to go back to this watch? Let's no, let's no, no, return no, the Pepsi. Honey, want to buy this one. honey, it's time to return the Pepsi. Yeah, it's, it's honey, the perfect watch. It is return really the Pepsi. Watch. Let's you put the Yacht Master back on. Let's calm down. Ever since you got Yacht Master, you got so no. No, violent. You're no, so con know. your confidence no, went up. GMT, roommate is like a Cock, bully. Cocky. Cocky. <laughs> cocky. cocky. I want GMT, that's it. Yeah, the Pepsi has done. done. Yeah, okay, so, hey. so I've got some interesting news. You ready for this for Rolex? Yeah. They're getting rid of they are getting rid of the Pepsi. No. How and, do you know this? This is secret. You ready, you ready for this one? Yeah. You've heard it for, first. They're going to have they're going to do the Coke. Oh my god. That's what I heard from a reliable. Pepsi's got well. You know what? I'm glad that this is what I've heard. Let that Muhammad Ali got his Pepsi before they're discontinued. I, I I don't know if it's true or not, but this I heard it from a very reliable source. Mm -hmm. That they they are getting rid of the Pepsi and they're adding the Coke. Mm. So, if we'll see what happens, I could be completely wrong. But I think I'm how could right. you could be completely wrong? What is what is this source? Who, who how could this, this source that you're source saying ex, the source is an so executive? This, the source is an is an executive from Zurich, Switzerland. That's all I'm gonna say. Careful. Oh, an executive. Very interesting. I heard it three days I believe, ago. Huh? I believe you. I heard it three days ago. I'm surprised you didn't haven't heard it yet. I well, we've been getting the hint for a while now. I think they're going to add the coke. No, I'm not naming if that. The actually, coke. happens. You know that the the world will actually explode. That's what everybody's hoping for. And if Rolex listens, I actually like I actually like the coke. Um, I actually like the coke. Um, looks better than the pepsi but i like the pepsi too but i like the uh, i mean i think if you're going to go for gmt they're they're either one would be beautiful but that's what i heard through the grapevine the gmt now hopefully that's true what i just said because otherwise i, I vouch for a negroni so that's just tells yeah. you who i am Ooh, okay? that would be bad no yeah. but you were right about other things so some other things i was right on yeah. correct but Negroni, it kind of fucked me up. Negroni, Negroni is a good guy. I like, I love him. I think he's like the gr a greatest guy going. I think he's phenomenal. I, I like his videos. I think I think he's I think he's a phenomenal guy. Some people just cannot handle wrenches. It, uh, as it, soon as I give them wrench, they go crazy. If I was, if I was my friends, it, if it's I was, wild. I, yeah, if I was like, if I was a little bit off the mean, I'd be Negroni. I am off the mean, but I mean, I'd be Negro. Mm -hmm. I don't get all the tattoos, but you know what? That's, that's a generational thing. His 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 wife's video was phenomenal. So all my kudos yeah. to him. He spent a lot of time with that. They spent a lot of time on that Tiffany dial. Did you see his uh, Instagram? He was doing something. No, I, I don't do Instagram. I don't do any of that stuff. I don't really? do... Oh, no, I'm not on Instagram. I don't do Instagram because a lot of the these these guys they post additional content. Yeah, I'm afraid of all that stuff. Oh, I don't do it. You can I do it anonymously. I don't do Facebook. I don't do Instagram. I don't do um, Snapchat. I don't do anything. My kids do. Look at that. He was to some fancy restaurant. Yeah, that. Well, that's San Francisco. No, he's like a Wisconsin boy, isn't he? Isn't he in like America, like Wisconsin? Uh, he, hold on a second. There's a big watch here that somebody just picked up, and they texted me the picture. It's freaking insane, guys. Yeah. Oh, well, sorry. What were you saying? Where's he from? I have no idea. Uh, because he lives in Green Bay, and I think America is from like, isn't he from like Madison or something? I used to date when I lived in Chicago for seven yeah? years. So Brody, 
fascinating. That's why I like him. He's from Chicago originally. So Brody was on the community channel with OC. Oh, yeah. That was like one of the best community ch- ch- channel shows today ever. Oh, yeah? Very knowledgeable. Yes. Very, very knowledgeable. So anyway, um, long story short, America's from Wisconsin too, right? I've never met bad people from the Midwest. I don't know why. I lived there for I lived in Chicago for seven years for various reasons. I loved it. But just the weather just sucked because it just changed all the time. That, Midwest, this is LA, right? Or what are you talking about? Chicago. Oh, Chicago is Midwest. So I think OC is going out to Chicago. Great city to me. Moving there or one more time, I didn't hear you. Is he moving there? No, OC? No. Yeah. No, no, Brody's from Chicago. Oh, he's from Chicago. Wow. And then he moved out to LA or Southern California. Yeah. Oh, okay. I get it. Oh, so America's from Wisconsin. Oh. So that's why he's like a everyone says he's I've never met him. He's like six four or six three, right? What is he? Irish or... no, that, well anyway, a lot of the biggest minor biggest minority race in America still is, are the Germans. Oh, okay. In the Midwest. Uh-huh. So they're, you know, you get the women that can plow the fields or the men that can plow the fields are huge. Mm. Midwestern guys are tip- are all like corn fed. Is that is Wisconsin? That's where a lot of those farms are. Uh, uh, I would imagine it's more German descent. I've never met a bad person though from Germany. I've dated a girl from, that was like Greek and German from Wisconsin. And when I lived in Chicago for like five years, um, long story short, I know Wisconsin pretty well. It's it's a great state. Uh, tell me about Milwaukee. You know Milwaukee? Yeah, it's okay. They brockwurst. That's about it. Oh, they like gardens and brockwurst. Brockwurst are like these like sausages. <laughs> They're really good, by the way. I asked you about the, the city of was of it's a beef. It's a it's a it's a beef. Sausages. Killing. I'm gonna be like killed on this if I start talking too much, but it's too late. It's a B city. It's a B city. It's not yeah. the top. I just what I heard. I I heard honestly. I heard it was shit. I, I heard it was like, really, no, 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 shit. People is who lived there, they hate it. They no, said shit it's gotta get Baltimore. better. No shit is Baltimore or Detroit. Uh, oh yeah. Well, I I heard it's kind of like that tier. Chicago's not though. There's Chicago has a little bit of a complex of not being New York, but it's a great city. It's a great. It, it, the restaurant scene there is absolutely fabulous. It's you can you the app. It's it's a great city. The weather sucks, but it's a great city, even with the politics going on. Going on. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Great city. Illinois is a, it's a great city. Chicago is a great city. So anyway, whatever. Oh, okay. Because there's this really famous if video. If Elson goes out to Chicago, you should go. Uh, to Chicago? Yeah, I think the awesome part. I heard that OC wants to go. No, I don't. That's not. Is that's, there like a concert? Is there like a D- ACDC concert or some bullshit there? I, I don't want to prioritize it. I don't, it's like. I yeah, you're traveling too much it. right now. You're, you're all over the place. I don't want to promote it. I'm going to tell you, you're, you're, you would be best off living in Atlanta and just flying everywhere. Oh, you yeah? Atlanta? Yeah. With a with roommate. Let roommate be at a nurse there. Is it? It's not that cheap. It's it's very hard to get around city. We're kind of we're very used to uh, small cities. Where the biggest problem with Atlanta is that they have walking. one. Yeah, I need yeah, to yeah, live yeah. in a city where I can do a lot of walking. I just I can't. Well, do it. Believe it or not, then you can. Okay, I understand. But you need a major airport too. Yes, I mean the Br- Brooklyn is fine for me for now. Chicago with weather sucks. Um, I I don't know what to tell. I I don't know what to tell you. You know, I don't know. The taxes in, in New York are just out of control. And also, if you're in any sort of business there, they they really do want to screw. They really do want to screw. You 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 switch. You will switch over sooner or later to a Republican. It's just a matter of time. I don't have to say. <laughs> that. Oh man, this election is going to be so brutal. And unfortunately, it's, it's very decisive. I've never, I've, unfortunately, it's really, really bad. But it's created by both sides. It's not one side. It's created by both sides. 
Exactly. Uh, um, yeah, I don't know. I, right. I hope that it's not going to be close. Uh, because well, you're right. I hope Trump wins big. So whatever. Wait, if he's gonna win, he's better. He's better win big. He's gonna bit. If, if he wins, he's gonna the... cry and bitch for another four years, and I can't. Uh, I, I win, wouldn't be able wins, to take all start. the whining. Okay, well, I hate to say this. If he wins, I'm gonna help him put a stink his stinking library on the at Gramercy Park on the west side of Manhattan. <laughs> so it pisses everybody off. <laughs> Hey, you have to see this watch, man. Oh my god. This this is top tier collector who watches the show. Great guy actually met him in uh in London and uh he was wearing a lumen, a datagraph lumen. Tim G, do you understand the caliber of that watch? Phenomenal. Outstanding. Yeah. Lumen at, especially at that time. Now the price has dropped significantly, but Back it then, it's, it's still it's still up there. No, I it's get it. still up there. No, it's still up there. It's still ungodly amount. But, but no, but it's it's price. Do you get it from high. an AD? Do you get it from an AD or do you buy it from a AD? AD. Oh, good for him. Yeah. So he's and, fine. He's and price okay. aside, price does it doesn't even freaking matter. It is a beautiful, beautiful watch. Check this out. He he just picked up this oh, watch. That's Whole, a sweet. Watch. That's a sweet watch. Wow. Oh my right, god. Good for him. That's a minute repeater color. Yeah, truck. obviously. I saw the thing on the left. Yeah. And uh, the the dial is like uh Paddock's Well, it's like 225 to 185 to 300 thousand dollars, somewhere in there. No, I think it's like more. Oh well, good for him even. But uh, they go look, they're these are impossible to get. You have to have been. Uh, well, he's uh, this, this is this, this is absolutely a different league at this level. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's the next level of the game. No, this, this is, is not, this is the final level. This is not the, the final. Season. Yeah. <laughs> at top with, tier, especially with Pat, top level, especially with Patak, because yeah, because I get I get. I get what AP does. You've got to buy a bunch of codes and you've got to buy a bunch of stuff before you get yeah. your first first um, World Oak. But AP, you really have to go through the progressions if you want to play their game, which I don't. I mean, I used to, but I after they took away the AD in New Orleans, I said, forget it. Oh, hey, we got, we got no, PG, PG in the chat. chat. PG... Uh, PG actually got some new watches as well. I'm hoping he'll be able to join us sometime uh, in the future. Near, maybe even if he's available right now, maybe he wants to join us now uh, to show his new pickups. There's some fun watches that PG got. He was he was away there for a little bit because of a bit, a bit of a health episode, but he's feeling better. Good. He's back to work. Uh, hey, a lot, of, a lot of the people in my office have COVID. My two offices, both. Oh, of them. No way. Yeah. What? They got COVID. Where, where are these offices? Uh, one's up in the northeast. One's down south. What the fuck? It's back. Yeah. I heard. I heard it was been. It's been going around again. So, so yeah. Is it a new COVID or is it still like the Omega? I, I don't, I don't know, but they have COVID. So. They did they say what what version this is? No, I don't know. Twelfth version. I don't know. I don't know. Damn. Anyway, this 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 what you have on on screen is a beautiful watch. So congratulations. Yes. Yeah. Look at look at this. It comes with graduation papers. Of course. The documentation. Really gorgeous watch. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh I, Even the hands are gorgeous on this thing. Oh my god. I mean, the dial's gorgeous. Everything's gorgeous. Look at this. I mean, it, it, this is a whole different level. I'm actually not even sure if I'm allowed to show these pictures. Well, it's too late now. You it's too late now. Uh, he sent them to me, so I figured. Well, you, I could, yeah, you uh, haven't doxed them, so you don't. We don't I, have I've to. been very careful. I mean, I'm looking at this stuff, and it doesn't look like I'm doxing anything. It looks. Well, Scotty like, H says it's eight hundred forty-nine thousand dollars. A oh my god! You see, it's uh, it's even higher than that. Because, but look, I mean, the 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 quality of work here. 
Been repeated. We're talking about the quality. Um, oh, it's it's absolutely that, it's absolutely magnificent. At the top level, yeah. As a matter of fact, matter of fact, this I is higher you, than Richard Mille. Okay, this there's a lot of people. That in my opinion, like, it it hundred percent. As a matter of fact, I consider this equal to like Roger Smith. Uh, I I I would say even higher. It's better finish. Yeah. I mean, and it's Roger just, Smith. So this is pretty damn good, and it's done at some quantity. It's like the work, uh, the work, the brand name, the heritage. I mean, it's it's just it's tough. It's tough to to get something that competes to anything. No, I'm in the I'm in the paddock big time. This is beautiful. I've never seen one. I've, right? I've never seen one ever. We're very lucky. To, to go for him, my kudos. On one, let me try to get something here for you. Guys. Plus, if you're buying it in Britain, you've got all the tax and everything else you got to deal with. Yeah, let's see. Oh, here we go. It's just a lot harder there for stuff to get stuff. Where in London, it's easy to get oh, stuff, no. it's hard for paying. Yeah, but uh, he's he's been he's been collecting for a very long time. Hey, yeah, is one of the OGs in the watch space who's been uh, very consistent. You know, um, I remember, I remember Russell and um, um, when the hype was going, when the hype was exploding. Uh, this collector, he 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 wasn't uh, like fooled by the hype. And now the hype died down, and he hasn't changed his pattern. So this guy is has this, he has been through the boom and bust. I see. I think. Well, he's probably see, he's pretty he's probably pretty established. So it's yeah, yeah. He wasn't fooled. You need to go through a couple cycles of this to see what's going on. Yeah, and exactly. And back then, I thought the hype was going to go on forever. Yeah, I, didn't I, know, I know. I know. I, I think. I think we're going to have a real estate bust too pretty soon. So yeah. It's gonna get even worse, maybe. Yeah, I'm starting to see it. I'm starting to see the cracks. Okay. I'm not talking about commercial. Okay. Very nice. This is the official video from the from the pad. Strap, like what a contrast and cool look. Beautiful case. Yeah. Need to find the sound. Buddy. Yeah, it's out of control, man. This is totally out of control. Beautiful. Is this absolutely, like, absolutely like, gorgeous. Like a work of art. Is this explanation how it, how it works? Or oh no, no, there's no video. Oh, it's too bad. Too bad. I wish there was more video. Um, yeah. I, I mean, mean I mean, the dial and the case back are just absolutely gorgeous. Oh, here, here we go. Pretty good, right? Awesome. So the wow. awesome, the awesome pawn in the chat said, "What's the size?" So I'm, I'm assuming it's like a forty-two. It's got oh, it. It, look at it. It's it's kind of small. It's, it is small. It's a 40. I'm curious on that myself. It looks good on his wrist. Yeah, it does. Well, it, this it, is it, not, this it, is it, not it, his it. wrist. This is uh, somebody else that was okay. the video was. But the uh, the other pictures was on his wrist. Uh but the, the focal length was kind of weird. Let me see. It's Grand Comp, right? Let's see. Is it in the collection still? Oh, here, there it is. There it is. Oh, it's beautiful. It really is gorgeous. 40. It's 40 millimeters by 10.5. Uh, it's wearable. Do you understand? Teeny, it's teeny for it's teeny for a minute repeater. Yeah. Teeny. I mean it's beautiful. The the the, the absolutely gorgeous. 
Where else do you get like minute repeater that's wearable? Did it show the price on Patek's website or no? Um, let's see. Maybe it does. No, on request. Okay, of course. Okay. Yeah. Wow. wow. So I guess the minute repeater for the old established watches are, is the most expensive complication. The second most expensive complication is the is the tourbillon. Well, I thought that's what makes some some uh, makes a brand a holy trinity when it has uh, a minute repeater. No, I don't know. I don't know that. I just. I think that's how it was. That's a bit of a wash, boy. Yeah. That's the next level. That's it, like again, it's, it's not the, the final level. level. It's, it's, it's the, the final level. level. Yeah. This is it's the final level. This yeah. is uh right there side by side with uh what's his you can, name? You, Smith. You can Smith, yeah, you can die yeah. with a smile on your face. Yeah. It, it's just different ways of doing the top watch. Top watch, yeah. Yeah, okay. it's a top, it's a top watch. Not any of that, but they have in the in the back they've got their own I don't know how they did that, but they've got their own um They've got their own, like, insignia on it, on the top. Patek Philippe? Yeah. Oh, oh, you mean this thing right here? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. What is that? It's it's ridiculous. It's the, I think it's a remontoire, or it's some kind of a part that, uh, because what happens when you activate the minute repeater? Yeah. It, it it apply it like charges a small like like uh it has like another power reserve right that when you pull it it charges that little different power reserve and this is like a regulator that you know makes sure that the power is not released too quickly unbelievable yeah and then the, yeah and the other thing is, is that's Patek the cage is, for it yeah so Patek is noted for the complicated for the complications, I mean, like this. Yeah, I mean, this is what they're really noted for, and 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 you know, I always say that Lange has the prettiest movements, but Patek has the like the, in my opinion, I'm going to be slapped on this in the in the chat, but has the most has the most like complicated and just gorgeous movements. This this is just a absolutely gorgeous watch. Yeah. Oh yeah, this is real deal. The real yeah. deal, man. It really is. Yeah, I like this stuff. Um, let's see, any more pictures it's, here? It's a, it's a watch that makes me happy. Yeah, I, it's a watch I I can't even get. So it's a watch that makes me happy. Mm hmm. This is you know you you can't get and like. To get, you have to have been getting watches for the past ten years plus. Yeah, ten years. Plus. Well, I, I did. I believe it or not, I had that in New Orleans. There's a watch company. Mm. There's a jeweler company, but they took the took it away. I had a, I had close to you know m close to a million bucks of spending history. Holy shit! But they took it away with my ex and everything. Yeah, they took it away during divorce. She kept the. No, no, they took it away. Be they took it away during the. They took the. They took the AD away from them. Oh, because where they were selling at the back door, huh? I don't know if that's the case. They just wanted to keep it more boutique. They have one in Metairie. No, they. I'm sorry. They have one. They have a Patek in Baton Rouge, but they don't have any more in New Orleans. I don't know what happened. It, it's still a Rolex dealership. Now look at this, uh, Tim. Tim. Tim, help me. Look at look at at this. Okay, this is yeah, a million dollar watch. The strap is so tight up against the lugs, right? That if you ever needed to swap a strap, you would most certainly scratch up the lug. Yeah, you say that, but you know what's also nice about that? Yeah. It's so close to the lugs that if you have a smaller wrist, it bends down better. Uh -huh. but, okay, they do that because it bends down better. Vacheron does the same thing. Yeah, but you're right. It would scratch. It would scratch. I wish that they had uh, those those deployant. Uh, sometimes they use them. I don't understand why here, 
Well, well it's this, interesting too. They didn't they didn't get a strap that wrap that the that the spring bar doesn't wrap. Spring bar, like the spring bar that has a little uh, pull yeah, tab. Yeah, 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 pull tab. Oh, it's a mock-up strap. Oh, okay. The real one has quick, quick release. Oh my God! Can you can you take a picture? I would love to see. It. Dang. Okay, that's good. It's beautiful. Because yeah, right, thing. like that. That was my. Because I could see in my head me trying to change a strap on that thing, and uh, the Bergian tool slipping and leaving a big gash. Now you got a, you got a super chat too. Oh, oh, here we go. Super chat from Pedro Bermudez. Five dollars super chat. That paddock, it's a beautiful piece. Oh my god, it's slim. Yeah. Yes, yeah, it's a sweet watch. It is. That really is a fucking nice watch. That's just wrong. Right? It is. Yeah, that's just wrong. It's really a nice watch. Wow. What the contrast. The blue and the orange, right? That's a really famous uh, two colors combination. They look good. I, I like it. Mm hmm. God, that's nice. It's freaking gorgeous. Better than sex. <laughs> well, I don't know about that. Yeah, I think it is. How about that? But probably, probably just as good. Well, this is craftsmanship, right? This is what. A lot of people get into watchmaking for for uh, because they like kind of stuff that's not easy to make. They like stuff that's really difficult. Yeah, it's really nice. Like I have no idea how they made this pattern. So unfortunately, or fortunately, I would rather have this than a than an RM. Ooh. And I'd probably take this. I would probably take this over a Roger Smith. You see, it's a smart choice. Let's see what kind of RMs they have on European. Or do they're they? Getting, believe it or not, they're getting more. They're getting more RMs, yeah. and they're getting more FP Jorns, which I'm getting a kick at. They have a ton of FP Jorns now. They've they've come up with a watch box with FP Jorns. Really? Yeah. What's the FP Shorn? Richard Milley. Okay, I couldn't find them in, in the brands. Oh, here we go. Yeah. I've, oh, that's it? Yeah. yeah. In, in Boston, I'm on, the, I'm on the list for the 6702. I don't think I'll ever get it, though. Wow. It's just plastic. Yeah. You, you just you need Ball. one. You just need one if you're if you're in this range. You don't yeah, need see, it. that's why I would go with what the Russell got. Like, look, these watches are so similar, right? One is plastic, one is metal, one is. I I I, I, hand, I, I would I take the paddock any day, but then again, I'm, all of a sudden I'm in the paddocks. Maybe it's my age. I don't know. Let's do a poll. Hey, oh hey, I had the poll going. Should I upgrade my Pam to the New York edition? Forty-seven percent said yes. Fifty-three said no. There you go. Incredible results. Uh, so I wouldn't do it, but still, that's a lot of people who would like me to upgrade it, and I think it would be a great story addition to the story of my collection. Anyways, uh, okay, let's do it. Let's do it. This is a final poll of the night. Uh, which watch do you? prefer let's see it paddock or rm on the screen which watch oh, shit which watch on the screen do you prefer God, that paddock is nice right that's that's a great i think that's a great question because these yeah. are two competing brands competing God, at the top that's, that's a nice right. watch it is right yeah the, the paddock is really nice the paddock is incredible. The RM is not bad either. It's the RM. The RM is nice. It's got maybe it's, <laughs> whatever. Oh my god! It's so cold outside. Guys, vote. We got a hundred people, hundred twenty-six people watching. Make sure to upvote the live stream. Um, let's see and answer the poll right now. It's. It's pretty one-sided. What is it all? Vote, 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 vote. 
What's this? Oh, oh. Huh? Sorry, Tim G. No, uh, the awesome pawn says e um, European watch company has a paddock grand complication for two million bucks. So go back to European watch company. I want to see this two million dollar watch. Which one? Where? European watch company has a paddock for two million dollars. Oh, it does really. Okay. Thank you, awesome pawn. Thank you. I'm gonna end the awesome poll. Pond, Looks like of, eighty. What part, what part of outside of Chicago are you from? Oh, he, he is from no no he's not from Chicago he's from uh, Atlanta oh that's right I knew that I knew that I'm sorry yeah. I knew that oh shit look at this even more watches oh oh what am I looking for a two million dollar paddock yeah speaking of two million dollars you go to brand you go to brands go to the, top go, OC okay go to the brands on top uh well I'm here I'm here I'm here look just oh yeah yeah, yeah. okay I'm scrolling you tell uh, me which one oh see yeah, there's a two million dollar yeah. paddock on European watch company. Do you want to see what it is? I do. I'm interested. Let's see. What oh, could so it you, be? You are the you are the show. So did you see the watch that Russell got? No, I didn't. Dude, the fuck? Were you living under the rock? Sorry. Bam. Oh wow. That's, oh. That's mental. That's just wrong. But Jesus, man. Um, uh, that's an amazing pickup. Jeez. Yeah. Extraordinary. And outstanding. Russell, he has really good taste. And he had the he had the um data graph lumen. I mean look at look, and, at, look at me paddocks stinking European white. There no, that's not there's it. this one for four hundred thousand, the three hundred eighty thousand. So this is like uh, this is like Russell's, but shittier. Yeah, a little shittier. Yeah, but not bad. Not bad. I take it. It's a great alternative if you because because the one that Russell got you cannot get, you, you can't get because the wait lists are too long. Okay, it, so so the awesome pond says use the filter in the chat. So how, I don't know how you use the filter in European watch company. Uh, yeah, I don't know either. Just what's it called? What is the name? What's the reference number? I don't know. Yeah. Anyway. OC, OC. When are you getting something like this? Probably never. When is your next watch, OC? It's been a long time since you got a watch. What's going on? It's scary. Freaking me out. No, are he's hiring out of the watch collector. He's, he's, not, he's not as long as I am. I'm, I'm waiting until like Labor Day. You never know. My next watch may be the watch that I just sent you uh -oh. in your WhatsApp. Uh oh, what's this? <coughs> okay. Oh, oh, what is this? Voodalan. What is this? No, show it. This is new. Oh, see, where did this came from? What's the image? Who leaked this? This is newly image. leaked image. <laughs> it's not. It's not actually leaked. Oh my God! Hold on. Oh, I, okay. So the awesome pawn says it's a sixty-three hundred one P, but we'll look at that later. The new Rolex Day Date Forty Everose Slate Ombre Dial for the ninety-sixth Academy Awards. Shut the fuck! <laughs> yep. Doesn't look half bad. It looks pretty good. It looks good. It looks, looks pretty good. It looks okay. But you've got you've uh, got a you got a a, a uh, you've got a day date platinum, right? I do. Wow, OC, that's a it's brand cool. new Rolex. It's a beautiful watch. It's a good dial. They get it's a nice choice. Uh, uh yeah, it it looks like the lights, you know, like in the in the dim theater. It looks like the stage. Yeah. It's so cool. It's like a movie Fuming. theater. Movie theater, you see the silver screen, but then the yeah. audience, everything is blacked out around it. Smart. Yeah. You know, smart. This is this is done. Uh, they announced this in conjunction with the 96th Academy Awards tonight. If you were smart, when this morning when you woke up, uh, Rolex uh -huh. released a video, a commercial 
that they're yeah. that they played during the Oscars. They have the prestigious first commercial after the first segment of the Oscars. And this is the watch that's featured at the end of the commercial. And they released it in the morning and the smart people picked up on this. I waited to see if anybody uh, if any, if anybody noticed this. And nobody really did. Hmm. The Ben Stiller. Who's the chick? Can you hear the, the audio? No. Have you ever felt this, this shiver, this call, this drive? I'll pick this one. And though it came with risk, you can. did you follow that light anyway and walk its path boldly? On your way, did you stumble? Did you face more than you could take? Quiet. Did you contemplate turning back, but instead couldn't stop and kept going? Did you find strengths you didn't know you had and make a new world for yourself? And after all was said and done, did you ever look back Blacklist. only to feel this is exactly where you were meant to be? Look sharp in that image, doesn't it? Wow. Wowzers. That looks incredible. It's very it subtle. It yeah. actually is a beautiful watch. If very you don't nice. know, you don't know. Right? Like Buckley says, if you don't know, you don't know. What, what's that running these days? What am I set back for? for like 41.5 maybe? That's like a pretty good deal for a stinking gold, all gold pretty watch. It's not that bad. Yeah. You know what? If they charge sixty grand for that watch, people would buy it. If you it's, don't know, you know. Rolex is starting to become reasonable. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a, it's a bargain, right? Is that, is that Louis like Vuitton a, just released a watch for two hundred forty thousand, two hundred forty thousand, two hundred seventy thousand, and nine hundred thousand? What? I mean, the, yeah, that could be a sixty. What kind of prices are those? Watch. That could easily be a sixty thousand dollar watch, easily. Yeah, yeah. The uh, MD Chaz asks, "What size is this? This is the D. This is the Day Date Forty in rose gold. Nice, even better. Perfect I like size. It. I like it, and I like fit. I like movies. So that's the perfect size. Can can we switch back to European watch company real quick? Okay. Huh. So the awesome pond. So we can just finish this topic, so we don't like leave it hanging. So mm -hmm. because I was annoyed. Okay. If you go into the main, you go just hit European watch company real quick. Uh huh. Uh, yeah. uh, oh no! Go into go into search. Search, okay. Yeah, and then hit six six three zero one p. Six three zero one p. And then hit search. That's what he's. Oh, about. wow! Mm -hmm. So they do have a two million dollar watch. Two million. So a a two hours. million a two million dollar watch or a two million dollar townhouse a condo in tribeca what would you prefer mm. 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 this is the only watch made by patek philippe that when you flip it over actually becomes uh six millimeters larger in size yeah how does that work <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it's it's shaped like a like a cone it's like a cone yeah, it's kind of <laughs> thick so. Like your hoke, like your, the soles of your hoka shoes. Yes, <laughs> but they do. Uh, the tops of them are like, like a little tiny cylinder, and the bottom of them like a giant, giant, giant pancake. A, oh, see, I had to, I had to tell the roommate to stop. We were, in, we were in the city, like two days ago, and she stopped by hoka shop, and she wanted me to take another pair, and I was like, you know what? I think I'm done with the Hocus. I'm going to go with a different brand next. I can't take this anymore. <laughs> no, she's just, she buy Ons. She just buy the Ons. Ons? The ridicule. Uh, Mrs. O.C. tried, on, tried on both the Ons and the Hocus uh, yesterday mm -hmm. at the mall. The, uh, the Ons are kind of cheap, I'll be honest with you. The yeah. Hocus seemed good, but she couldn't decide on the color. So 
Okay. There you go. Okay. Yeah. I'm, I'm just going to go back to my air trusty Air Force Ones. Go back to the good old days. Let's not overcomplicate here. This is not. Uh, I go to. I go, to Amazon, I go to Amazon and buy twenty nine dollars sneakers. Is that an awful thing to say? Whew. it's crazy stuff. Yeah, the watch in the front is thirty seven point five millimeters. And then when you flip it over, it's a uh, gargantuan forty four millimeters. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Well, you know what? Look at look at how many pictures they've got. They've got like ninety pictures on this thing. Hey, you're selling <laughs> yeah. a two million dollar watch. You don't you don't skimp on the photography. Yeah, you show every single angle. You show it with a model. You so show why, why is this two million bucks? Look, because it's got its own documentation. I mean, does it does it blow me or is it just a twenty nine million dollar watch? Hey, it's a I mean, show. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Well, I think the girl that that well, listen, if if you get, if you have this watch, I'm sure you got somebody getting that work done. <laughs> yeah. Damn. I don't know if it's worth two million bucks. So it's uh, it's worth whatever they're selling it for. If you don't want it, you don't have to buy it. That's how the, this works. That's why my uh, Maurice Grossman is now officially forty thousand. If you don't want it, don't buy it. In a couple Price of months, it's going to be fifty thousand. It's your loss. Yeah, I'm giving a discount. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Well, it's just the truth. I'm just. I would. I would. I would go to European watch company. You're welcome, even if I'm not there, you're welcome to stay at the house in, in Boston, which is 40 minutes away, so you got to take the train. But I would go there, take the Grossman, take the take the Sermit, and trade in for an AP. Yeah. Sermit. That's what I would do. E equal trade. You get You get a chrono. You think they would do that? Should I do that or see it? Think about it. The AP. Did you see it? This was a Boston, Boston collector. Can I, take I don't you know out. if they're going to do it. There. Jeff can take you out. The boss contingencies out. MJ will take you out. What do you think? All these, all these Boston people who I haven't met. Maurice Grossman plus Sermit for this AP. We'll see. What do you think? Is this a good trade? That would be I, a pretty good it, trade. It will be. Look at the, it will be, I, I will start great. collecting white dial pandas. It will be my second panda. And then I can get the speedy panda. And then I got three pandas. I'm panda. I got, you could flex with o, uh, Oshin. I've got a zoo. I, I, could, I could start giving people tours of my, of my zoo, panda zoo. <laughs> and then, and then it, this would break in like 24 hours once you get it because this... I'm never going to run the chronograph. That's yeah, you just don't run the chrono. Matter of fact, matter of fact, it doesn't exist. It just you just buy it. Brody, it. Brody, ten dollars super check. Can we go back to warning the community that the code eleven fifty nine is great? Is a toxic lie. We tell ourselves when AP makes you walk the plank for the Royal Oak. Absolutely. Ouch. Yeah. Or even worse, that entry level model with the rubber gasket. I actually thing. like. Oh, see, I actually like that. <laughs> I mean, so, yeah. I, I'm thinking, I mean, yeah, I'm in yeah. these. I, I go to a, I go to a tennis event with my cousin in all these hot, like hot, sweaty places. That would be a perfect hot, sweaty type watch to, to wear. I actually yeah. like that little. Brody's, like Brody's, that. Brody's, huh? Brody's right. We've 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 bamboozled ourselves. Absolutely we've been brainwashed. It's thing, like I wouldn't. I, other than the sixteen two hundred two, I other than that and that cheap watch, I wouldn't want anything else. Remember, That's going to be I, the, the line of the year. Is the line that Tim G just said? I actually like that one. <laughs> I like actually like that one. Yeah, I actually like that one. For twenty five six is a deal. As a matter of fact, they texted to other people and they they're going to be getting their names on the list too. Mm -hmm. What if I told you it wasn't twenty five six? What it was a uh, it was a, it was a massive twenty six five. Then how would you feel? Uh, huh? Huh? Five. It doesn't make a difference. Plus tax. It's fine. <laughs> Six percent. It's fine. Can we get back to the Rolex? Man, that's stunning. Yeah, Rolex, it's, please. It's nice Rolex. It, oh, see, that's real. Is a really nice <laughs> Rolex. Really, really nice. I sent you a picture in your uh, WhatsApp. It might oh. look better colors than the Instagram post. Maybe I don't know. Okay, let's see. Let's see the picture. Buckley, Buckley would, would like that. Yeah, but he has one. He has one that's very similar. You know what? He's very sneaky now. He's almost like I am. I don't know what he's got. Did he get rid of that Yacht Master 242? 
That's what I told him to do. I recommended. Uh, I called okay. Buckley. Uh, I I, actually, I did a live stream and I told Buckley, dude, you need to move it. It's a war uh, warning. I, like it. I, I had like a it. dream. They, they, they dropped too much. That's the only problem with those. There you go. I, Boom. I like oh, that's a beautiful watch. You see that? Maybe uh, see it? that's like foreshadowing. I, I warned Buckley that something better was coming. Oh, see, that is definitely you. Stunning. It's stunning. Are you going to get this one? Because you're a no. huge kind of cinema <laughs> freak, OC. You I love know. cinema. Oh, this she is watch. is going to lose his mind over this. That's a good looking watch. This is a okay. winner. This is a big winner. I, I actually, I could get, I, if I, when I get my next watch, if I get tired of the Platinum Day Date, I could downgrade. No, you, pocket, no. I could pocket cash and get wow. this one. No, no, no. Do me a favor. You keep that. You keep that platinum. That's I can't keep everything, Tim G. That's the only watch you should that's the only watch you should really keep if you're gonna get rid of any. You see? Uh, I'm like it's rough. It's really rough. a nice watch. Matter of fact, the community, matter of fact, community doesn't like it when you when you get rid of watches. Well, the other thing is they're enablers, Tim. They want you they to want keep me to eating. get rid of everything, but but no, well, the thing you. is, Timmy, you've got too much shit under five grand. That's the problem. You've got too much. You, the PAM or the IWC, and then you got everything else underneath there. You're holding on to Mings. You're holding on. These brands may not even exist in five years. Oh, see, did you see the ti the Titanium Panera New York Edition? That's a cool <laughs> idea. I was thinking I'm going to upgrade my steel it's one to the New it's York. The, it's titanium. It's the GMT. Of the Empire State Building on the, on the no, dock. No, no, it's back. got Brooklyn Bridge. It's got the Brooklyn Bridge. And on guess what I'm known for? Burning bridges. It's got the Brooklyn Bridge. On Ooh, the it's perfect. Well, you should show them that watch. You just said laugh. It's just got to... Yeah, but people don't look at the back. Well, I would show unless them. Unless you're wearing it reverse. It's impossible. Have you ever done that? I've I've done I'm it. Gonna on my I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. Somehow, somehow, some way. That'd be a good story. But yeah, this one, OC. You like the Academy Awards? Did you watch it? Uh, I've been watching. Yeah, right any now, surprises? Yeah. It's it's really really well produced. Very very who, good. Who Jimmy won, Kimmel is who won, excellent. Who, who won the best uh, woman actor? That's not up yet. Okay. That's, that's, all I woman, care. that's all I care. woman actor. Yeah, actress. <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna jump off because my daughter's here. I'm been hanging out with her. So I'll okay, no, we're moment. gonna. We, I was gonna wrap it up 15 minutes ago. So let's. Uh, it's a good show. Good show, everybody. Oh. Peace out. Now we'll be back tomorrow, right? How many? How many episodes do you have? We're gonna talk about the Oscars tomorrow. Uh, I'm gonna try to, to get the list. Of all the winners, the losers, and the watches of the wrist. So make sure you're back here, okay? Don't go anywhere. Become members. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. And if you like the show, you can support it via PayPal. Um, yeah, I still haven't paid the rent. Uh, okay. My mom is on the uh, trip.